Let's start recording going. now, then. All right, go for it. No. Before you start recording, right above general chat, like chatter here, it's a channel called Game Art. The last Game Art was posted on the four, tw on the twentieth of the fourth, twenty eighteen. Because we put him in dump. Boy. Know, this is no, this is Game Art for like character things. Like, the thing Ernie doesn't want us to post in. Oh yeah. Yeah. He literally made it. Actually, no. He actually made this after I joined. Yeah, he did. <clears throat> Anyways, um, <laughs> hi Anna. How are you? Hello. Hi. How are you? Um, I'm okay. You sound I tired. I just woke up. Yeah. Yeah. Get some coffee, girl. <clears throat> All right. Last <laughs> clean. Uh, I, 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 see, I would have a cup of coffee, but I'm out of coffee grounds. <gasps> I know, it's blasphemy. That is blasphemy. Well, so, that so, is... This, so on a military base, the uh, stores are closed on Mondays, so I couldn't go shopping yesterday to get some. You always wonder, why was away. it on a Monday, you know? I, I have no fucking clue. Like, Sunday. Like, everyone is like, why not Sunday? That makes yeah. sense. Because it's, it makes because... no sense. Like, I lived on a Sunday... base for about a year. It was stupid. Everything yeah. is, like, done. I know. Like, and it's and it's a wor normal work day for me. Oh, well, it used to be. I have to deal with my cousin now. calling me about, like, being on a base, and he's always complaining, and I'm like, well, the okay. One thing I've learned, if any rule is put in place, it's because some idiot got themselves killed but not following it. Because right. someone got killed Close, on a Monday. Closing everything on a Monday that has nothing to do Dude, with that. Dude, literally, no, we can't use power washers at my work anymore, because some guy electrocuted himself with one. I mean, <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. But there, that, that's that's one thing, but having everything on base be closed on a Monday, nah. That's just so people don't work a seven-day work week. But why did they choose Monday? Sunday makes because more sense. Because you, awesome. so you don't get the Monday blues. Oh, my Fucking god. It's probably <laughs> the day that they have the least amount of business. It probably is, honestly. Oh, true. They probably did survey my day was a little less. You're, you're, yeah. you're most likely right. Because they have to run that... services and shit on Sunday, don't they? For religious people. Yeah, they do. Yeah, they have chapel. We, we have two chapels on my. Anyways, uh, you can start recording now, Quincy. I've been recording. Oh, yeah. uh, oh, you recorded all of that? So yeah. You recorded all our no. personal business. Thanks. No, I haven't recorded any personal business. Off. I've had this on, thing on Game Art the whole time. I'm just glad you guys don't know my real name. <laughs> so you don't, you're not actually saying. Your, your, your real name is motherfucking death killer. There we go. That's kind of. Do you want me to find? Do you want to? Like, you... I popped out and my mom's like, yeah, that's yeah. his name. Do you want me to find your real name? Great couch. No, I absolutely do not want you to find my real name. His name's Mick. That's his name. Alrighty, everyone. Let's get this party started. Alrighty, then. So, <laughs> as always, everyone gathers up. We all teleport back to the Convergence. Matt will go find uh, Anna, or Alexa. I, I mean, I would accompany <laughs> you in that. I mean, it's just, I'm not going to... Yeah, Matt's I know you're not going to roleplay. Yeah, Matt, Matt is in NPC mode. While you're off heading toward the docks, you see a familiar-looking cart. It has a lot of things think. on it. It has the four floating discs. However, there's no lizard person in front of it anymore. What? So it was just it's a goblin. Card. Oh. You see a oh. goblin standing there with the six looks, with the same looking whacking stick staff in his hand. Also, same height and everything. Yeah, like a small goblin holding this really tall staff. The fucking staff is the merchant, isn't it? And he's <laughs> <laughs> and you see her. Standing there, her uh, smuggling or not smuggling, uh, swindling people. Swindling. <laughs> and she and she sees all your familiar faces, and she points at Quincy. Or sorry, not Quincy. I was oh man, raised right here. God damn it! But she also points at Quincy, and she like does her finger to come here. <laughs> Just a second. Just a second. That's my response. <laughs> um, she's still she's still pointing at you and just like sees you. Are you fucking kidding me? With a twenty six. May I see thirty five? Oh, you that you fuck. 
Wait a minute. I can make that. You could, yeah. but are you going to really spend yeah. points on it right now? All right, what do you need, miss? Like, come here, please. Yeah? Come closer. No, thank you. No, come closer, please. Uh, I do not... I don't think solicitations are needed. No, no, come here. I got something for you. Taking the dodge action. <laughs> the dodge. Okay, take the dodge action. Do you get really close? Uh, I get close enough that she can talk to me, but not closer. Ah, come closer. <laughs> May I ask why? I have a secret to tell you. Oh, no. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> also, my... Oh, hold on a second. My vo All right. oh. I have a secret to tell you. Come here. Oh, I can help with that. Wick, get over here. Uh, no, no. Uh, only you and I, Quincy. Come here. Oh, what the hell is... Okay. It's like... I'm going to... Don't worry. I can hear. Just whisper it. No, no. Come closer. Crash down there. To my, my, okay, my I'm watching, like, a hawk right now for anything. That's... Come Raven closer, please. Oh, uh, what is it? I'm Are gonna... you, like, near her mouth and everything? Was she whispering in your ear? Um, I'm listening for her whisper. I'm getting... Can I just come go... Come here, come closer. Uh, what the hell is... Dude, what's with you? I'm just walking here. Come closer. I'm walking here. All right. I want to whisper uh, something in your ear. Unless you want everyone here to hear it. Okay. 30 gold. <laughs> it, this is for you, not for me, man. Come here, come closer. Uh, it's like, Wick, if I'm about to explode... You, I promise you, you will not get hurt at all. Nothing bad will happen to you. Flashbacks to Matt's contract. <laughs> <Cool>. <laughs> fine, fine. Ooh, I'll, lis I'll listen right. in to her ear. Alright, she says... She gets really close to your ear, and she just whispers, I know you cheated, and she boops you on the head with her staff. <gasps> <laughs> I took the dodge action. I would like to see an attack roll. It's she doesn't have an attack roll. She's an NPC. Like you it's, always it's, it's give NPCs. Happen. You always give NPCs stats. Uncanny dodge. It doesn't matter. <laughs> you can't you dodge her half of her spell. It doesn't happen. Anyways, everyone sees Quincy's hair turn pink. <gasps> <laughs> what the freak? Oh sweet! I'm not going to judge. This is great. This actually matches my color scheme. Oh my. I'm gonna oh go over God. to her. I'm sorry, what was that? Oh, well, you see, your friend here used a mystic friend over there of his to cheat. Honestly, it's well played, but I didn't like it, so I turned his hair pink. You know, good on you, good on you. It's like, <laughs> you can just feel the DM Matt being nettled. Like, he just needed to get back at me for playing his own game. <laughs> Who is Matt? Uh, huh. He sounds so, like a handsome fellow. Did I say it? Did, did I have my accent on, Matt? I, I can't tell. Do I have my accent on? I'm um, yes, yes, you do. Now I have my accent back also, on, Matt. Yeah. She says, now, since you since I got that out of the way, say hello to my nephew. Wait, what? Is, is there a little <laughs> goblin standing next to him? No. He, Are you the little nephew? <laughs> well, I think only he can go talk to him. Unless you also joined, as he turns to as the goblin turns toward you, Mochello. Now, who wants to make some trades? What the shit? I would love that. I'm yes. just gonna push all that side of my mind. All right. So, what do you have in terms of flying? Flying. Hmm. Like, I have a yeah, flying. I, want to fly. I got a magic broomstick. I have wings from an angel. I can put on your back. Oh, that sounds pretty dope. Do they retract or are they just there? They just there. They're just there. <laughs> um, do you have like a cape or something? Like, because I mean, I'm a I'm a local guy. I want to do business with you. I don't want to have to go to the yellow house to go get my crap. I would really appreciate if we could work something like, like a cape, a cloak, anything. I can't hear you because Tritska's in the background. Oh my bad. How much of that did you not? Uh, the last half. So I heard something about Yellow Hell. Uh, yeah, no, I said I, I basically said I'm a local kind of guy. I don't want to have to go to a big corporation like the Yellow House to do my business. I hope we can work something out. And I said like a cape or something. Well, what do you have to offer for currency? 
Well, I tend to work in trades, and I will hold up like discreetly so probably just me and her can see the roach mm -hmm. of darkling mm, interesting interesting useful yes it, mm. it is however i currently have my own ways of achieving this same purpose ah so this is useless to you therefore this is useless to me no not at all it can be useful to many others but you, you said you could already thing. use it in a different way thus you have no use for this brooch thus it's useless to you thus it's useless to me not at all. I can only do it twice a day. This can do it infinite times a day. Forgive me, but you are incorrect in your statement. Then why are you offering it? Am. Those who offer things willingly means they are okay to lose it. They have no sentimental value to it. I care about things that people care about the most. I do care about this, and that's why I'm not going to give it to you unless you give me something of greater value. That is why... I'm asking, do you have anything I want? Oh. And if not, I should take my deal. You think you get the better end of the deal here? Eh, maybe. Depends. I made a few mistakes in the past. Where is your scaly friend, though, who kept calling me brother last week? What is your name, anyways? I can't say hi to your nephew, but I don't know who he is. When do you like to know? Anyways, so this brooch. And you want to be able to fly with this brooch. I want to be able to fly with something. Okay, it could be a cape, cloak... Just something retractable, like probably not wings. <laughs> I think my other ASMR friend would kill me. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So you want to be able to fly. You know what? Sure. I will take this brooch and I will give you an ability to fly. I'll give and you an item that allows you to fly. What item is this? Hmm. Well, would you prefer a pair of boots or some wing or for a cape? I would prefer a cape. I already got cool boots. Alrighty then. Okay, so can I see them first before she takes out? Are they like glowing with a dark aura? Um, well, she just pull out a nice, um, red cape with a oh. gold trimming. Oh, they're... and she would just mm -hmm. very stealthy. Hand it to you. And I'm I'm just going out on a limb here. Can I can I make an insight check on her? Like, would she try to? If you want to try to insight her? Sure, go for it. Actually, no, no, because I feel like she feel not react to that. I was, your NPC Matt is still there, right? NPC Matt is still there, yes. Okay. Hey, he's then... gonna make a trade here in a minute. Okay. Ooh. Um, would you, just because I wanted to make sure it meets my specifications, uh, Matt, can you please, would you, I turn to the sales goblin, uh, yeah. is that if my friend identifies this quickly for us? He can look at it. There's no, no problem with that. Okay, so Matt does look at it. There's, what are the specs on it? Oh, well, Matt doesn't have the goggles with him right now. Oh, but... you're Why did you bring the goggles? He can't tell you that they are magical as fuck. Okay, and any curses or anything? I mean, you rolled a 25. <laughs> um, Matt would say there are no curses. And the, and the goblin lady, you don't trust me in my, in my sales. Not at all, but... You have to bring a I'm mage. Sure you understand. Hmm, I'm insulted slightly. You shouldn't be insulted. You should be honored that someone <laughs> like me... Would buy your equipment. Your empty words those... mean nothing oh, to me. Mm. Do you have anything well, else then. to trade or not? Yeah, I do. I give her the brooch. <laughs> right. I, th she already, I thought you already gave her the brooch. My bad. Yeah, right. no, I take, she takes I the take brooch. The she just tosses it over her shoulder into into the um, <laughs> cart. Okay. Hmm. I'll be back next week. Perhaps I can buy something else. Yeah. Thank you for your. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I will tell, send you what the cape does later, yep. uh, Michella. Okay. I kind of want to use it today. Is there any chance you send? Do you have it written out, or do you need to already? Write uh, it? I gotta finish writing it out. Aren't you, okay, don't no, you have three attunement slots right now? I would. I have two. I took off the yellow circlet. Gotcha. So I just have the boots in my armor. Okay. Here's a question. Don't you Answer. owe me a secret? Don't you owe me a secret now? That was your offer. Do I owe you a secret? I mean, I already knew I cheated, and you offered me a secret to lean in and. I did offer you a secret. Yeah. I told you a secret. Just, you yeah. gave me an order. You didn't tell me a secret. I did and give you a what's secret. What's the secret? The nephew thing? <laughs> you ask too many questions for someone who has pink hair. <laughs> it's like, you okay, think the pink okay. hair are the most questioning I like people. This lady. I like okay. I'm going to actually take a step forward. Well, hello again. I look at the stick. Hello! Oh, um, like, the goblin. Time around. Look at the goblin. Look at the stick. Look at the goblin. 
I wonder, do anything led to me this time around that isn't a mind flayer, but brain? Hmm. Well, I did think of you when I went out looking for to restock last week. Do you have an item I think you'd be interested in? You have Shoot. my undivided attention. The goblin would crawl up over the edge of the cart, be rifling around, and she would pull out a crossbow. <laughs> she got you with a crossbow. I am not so good with crossbows. Mm. Well, it's a special crossbow. You don't... What? You, you only need to use your mind. You don't really have to aim. Oh, that is sick, Wick. Oh. <laughs> that is awesome. Do you, mind give a, do you mind if I give it a once over? You might be my guest. You have yet to insult me like one of your friends. I did not insult oh, I you. I merely identified it. Makalo, just shh. I have no need to insult you. He grab, takes off while he looks at it and gives it a once over. Do you make an arcana check or anything about this? or? I mean, you can make a check if you want to. Yeah, I'll check it out, see exactly what this thing actually does. Uh, yeah, well, well, well. Alexa, play Despacito. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, um, wait, you realize it is not magical. <laughs> no, 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 <laughs> but, but, like, you yeah, Oh no, is it psychic? That's what I'm saying, I'll do a psychic. It's, it's not word. psychic and it's not magic. Looks at it. So it's just a crossbow. Well, it's a crossbow that you. It uses a little bit different uh, skill sets to use. Okay, now I'm worried. Did I just buy a regular cape? <laughs> no, your cape is magical, and it will allow you to fly. I promise. That did you. not have the. That did not have the accent. That was not Chow. That was that was me. It is hard to tell when you people are talking. Gosh, dang it. Sorry. Um, Anyways, um, Mr. Would you Inquisitor. Mind would you mind ex ex looks? Would you mind explaining? Well, because she kind of just looks over um, to the side and see there's like a bale of hay. Just go shoot it. Get a test shot. Is there a so she'll give you, she'll give you a bolt. A bolt. Just yep. a normal ass bolt. Yes. Bolt. You can shoot it using bolt. your intelligence. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that's. Okay, that's actually pretty fucking helpful. <laughs> Yes. You can aim with it and shoot it and everything. Just replace dex with intelligence. That is it. Oh, that's sick. That's actually quite sick, because I can also enchant this thing, too. Wait, does it stack? Is it a heavy crossbow or crossbow wondering? Uh, just a normal crossbow. Sorry, I'm just looking it, at it. It is two-handed. It is two-handed, but it's normal. So it's quite like a light, light crossbow? crossbow? Light crossbow? Uh, I think it's light, yeah. It's not, it's not a hand. I think it's light. <clears throat> Like, got it. All right, two headed. Yeah. Yeah. I'm actually adding it to my sheet for a second to look at. It. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So I'm assuming you just give it a test shot, whatever. Um, yeah, I give it a test shot. Look decently surprised. Like, oh, where did you get well, this from? This is quite intriguing. Honestly, I forget. I've had it for like 17 centuries. That's that. That's an indeterminate amount of time. Okay. Um. Hmm. Well, let's. What are you willing to thing. offer for it? I do value this item decently high. Wait a minute. Oh, sorry. Sorry, sorry. Just oh. I, I was thinking. Let, finish first, and then I'm gonna say my thing. I do value this decently highly because it will help me through some issues. But yet again, I do not. I would like not to overcharge and give you something insane like a part of my soul, which understandable, mm -hmm. correct? And, I mean, if you want to give me a part of your soul, I'm more than willing to take it. What would you do with it? <laughs> what you'd like to know? I just don't want to know no, not really. Generally curious. So, what are you willing to offer? Memories? Skills? Languages? Memories? Knowledge? Health? Spirit? Other items? Normal, normal gold currency? What is your willingness to part in with base, for this? In a in a base plan that says I'm quite budget tight on everything, so everything's quite available at the moment. Mm -hmm. Gold wise, as a current standard, what would you take gold wise for this? No less than three hundred and sixty seven. I fucking hate you, Yuki. <laughs> <laughs> Looks 
Okay, my message to people, I'll leave a ca uh, character. Can I have an IOU for some of you people and just pay back after the How mission? much do you need? I have 180 right now. <laughs> so, how you know, much I, was it? Um, I need like a 200 and I'll pay back 200. With interest, of course. I would, course but I want, I'm interested in buying, so I won't. <laughs> Plus. It's good. Interesting. This is not the same, it... same dude as last week. It's the it's the goblin. Yeah, I'm not even into. Yeah, it's a goblin this week. So nope. Yeah, no business from her. All right. So wait. So who's willing to help go fund me a crossbow? Wait. How much do you need, and how much do you have? I I just need two hundred more, and I can pay for this easy peasy. Hey Ray. What's up, Ray? We're doing merchant right now. I mean, let me ask you this, Rankar. You would see Driska's kind of standing aloft, not coming anywhere near her cart. Um, and you could go to him and talk to him. Yeah, well, actually, well, first things first, I would ask everyone here and, and wants to partake in the uh, GoFundMe. <laughs> Just assuming no one would, I guess I'll go to Driska then. Mm. Hi, Rankar. Hi, uh... Okay, I'm not gonna ask now because you don't seem the best. What's happened? Mm? You seem off. Your voice is different. Your posture is really different. What what happened? Mm. Power's growing. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> Dritz, are you? Dritzka, are you... how much are you hanging out with Matt lately? Sweat beads off head. Out of character, quite a bit. <laughs> Oh god. I asked that in character. You're not with me, all the rank guards with me. We're all around the merchant, aren't we? Nope, I am not. Uh, Dritz gets away from it. I, I'm, oh. I don't I want goblins. I put, I put the crossbow back, say I'll be right back, I need to check a few things. I go wait check for <laughs> Dritz for a second, since no one said to go fun me. Right. Gotcha, my bad, I didn't hear you say go away. So, I think I got a name for our merchant at least. At least a nickname. Oh. I just need um a gold a, a gold sum which I can pay back pretty quickly. Just two hundred in total I can pay it back to you and need to pay it back to with some interest. He goes in his pockets. Starts counting a bag, puts it out. Alright. How much do you need? Uh, just two hundred and I can pay back immediately after the mission, along with some other jobs you get done, I can pay it back that quickly. He tosses you a bag and says, Alright, you can have 200 gold for a turn, 225. Easy. Did he get an accent, or has he always had that accent? It's gotten darker. It's been a little bit more, uh, boys. Before. Oh, no, it's cool, man. No, it's just cool. <laughs> well, that plus I have a laptop, so I don't have to, like, play in front of the puppy, so. No. <laughs> Alright, so I will go get the gold, go back to deal, and say, well, I'm lucky I could scratch up cash for a intelligence-based crossbow and put all the cash out to the trader. Would this be acceptable? The goblin will take the bag, wait in her hand, toss it over her shoulder into the, the cart. Thank you. You can keep the crossbow. And yes. because I'm such a nice person, I'll throw in ten bolts. Ah, oh, thank you. Grab his bolts. I have, shoulder. I have like 30 bolts if you do need some, by the way. <laughs> I, this is a last resort, so it should be fine. Thank you. Kind of looks at the no crossbow. No problem. Like, I'm going to enchant the shit out of this when I get money back out of the pain, Dritzka. <laughs> is it already a magic item? No, it's not. It... Oh. The crossbow that uses intelligence magic. isn't magic? Yeah, it just uses different stat. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, it's, it's just, it's just it's made it. differently. Yeah. It's oh. very hard to make item, most likely, though. It requires intelligence to make it. Oh, probably. right. It, it's a female goblin. Everything else is the same, except it's a female goblin. <laughs> it's right here. Oh, yeah, yes. Right. Dude, please type in roll 20. Is Ray so muted again? I swear to God, if he is. I don't think he is. Uh, yeah. Mike? Oh, he's not in the game? He he's not in the game. Yeah, uh, yep. He can't show up today. He might just be hopping in for a couple seconds. Oh, gotcha. <sighs> okay. Um, does anyone else want something from the goblin? Because if not, I just um, need to ask a question. I'm curious about if you have any Inferno Steel. Inferno Steel, you say? Sadly, yes. I do not. I can have some next week, though. 
All right. What would the price be? Depends on what you want. Do you just want the metal? Do you want to forge it into something? Do you want it to be heavily enchanted? Do you want to be able to summon the wrath of the nine demon lords? That last one sounds pretty good. Or do you just want to just shoot some fire at it? Didn't you say infernal at the monic? <laughs> just silence. <laughs> huh? What's going on? Well, you said nine demon lords, and then it was infernal steel. Demon lords would yeah. be abyssal. Yeah, um, this, the infernal steel does both, I believe, if I remember correctly. No, I thought it's, I'm it's, it's, it's in anything from the hell planes, any magic from down there. Because I yeah, think it's, it's fiendish. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's so it fiendish. Yeah. I mean, fiendish steel makes more sense, because I thought infernal was unique to devils. I, I knew what she meant. So, um, um, yeah, it's fiendish steel. Yeah. Um, but yeah, anyways. <laughs> So many options. Uh, whatever you recommend, really. I'm just intrigued to get some. Well, I could always sell you knowledge. I have many books of legendary weapons and armor. How much would the book be? Yeah, it depends on what kind of book you want. The rarer the book, the higher the price. By chance, do you have a book on Hell Knights? Funny enough, you should ask. I just do. How much would that book cost? Hmm. Well, it depends on how far you want to take it. I can unlock your powers for a Hell Knight. I can unlock bloodlines. I can unlock untapped magic. Of course, the price is quite steep, though, for all these things. How much would it be to unlock my bloodline? Three stat points. Ooh. Just take a couple hits from the curse stick. <laughs> <laughs> Your hair will just like five, right? Probably ten. If you yeah, don't want to do that, I can do perhaps something else. How does hmm. you're a centurion, correct? Yes. What if I were to take your one of your uh, abilities away? Or better yet, you're a tiefling. What if I took one of your tiefling abilities away? Hmm. I will do that. If you don't want to do the stat points, I will remove your dark vision. You can get goggles. That's actually a pretty good deal. No wait. I she has the special dark vision. I believe is a tiefling. Let me check. Races tiefling. No, I think it's just normal. So you're talking about oh, superior dark vision? Normal. I think are you talking about superior dark vision? Oh Drow's only got that. Alright. Yeah. Um <coughs> That's still good though. You she agreed to it. I'd take that, make some uh, dogs. I work. thought she had something else, my apologies. What about I'm a feral tiefling. Should I you're mention feral. that? Oh you're a feral tiefling. Ooh. You should mention that. <laughs> <laughs> Matt's king. Oh god. Yeah, well, <laughs> I'm so sorry, I regret saying that. How about this? Wow. I would take away your hellish resistance. You take and my hellish Ooh. one stat point. I will give you the book Ooh. and I will unlock a, your, your untapped bloodline. So I get the book and my bloodline unlocked. If you give me your hellish resistance. My hellish resistance and a stat point. I'm just. Yes. Um, I think that's a fair agreement. Alrighty then. Goblin holds her little hand out. Do we have a deal? Raven extends her hand and holds her hand. Yes, it is. And she would shake on it. You would lose. You could choose which stat point you want to lose. And then she will also take away your hellish resistance. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Let's get um, the line table rolling here, boys. Oh, uh, no. Table. Well, because of her uh, background, she only has one bloodline, so. So you just gave her the maximum one? Uh, Ernie has it um, written down somewhere. Uh, I'll let him know. 
Matt's in the background wow. losing his shit over this. <laughs> I got, I'm missing Ernie. Um, <coughs> Cause this is, wasn't this like part of Matt's big goal? Help Raven unlock Bloodline. Yeah, Matt's gonna. Matt's just standing there, just like. Mm, mm. Oh, actually, Matt would probably be jealous because he thought he could do a better job. Well, Matt can't unlock it. He thought he knew somebody could do it, but she traded it away for it. And that's her choice. Yeah. <laughs> that is not what Matt is thinking. I swear. Matt's salty. Yeah. yeah. That's what Matt will say, but that's not what he's thinking. Wait. Okay. So can I go back over to the Goblin Lady? Sorry, don't want to take up any more of your time, but you said something of Hold on, hold on. Ray oh, is... Sorry, sorry. Been... Yeah. Sorry. Uh, Ray will do you next. Oh, Ray is here? Uh, he's... He's he's here in spirit. He's here in Discord. <laughs> he wanted to get... He really wanted to meet this merchant, I think. Oh, yes, but he's, he's here I can unlock your bloodline. Or, yes, my lizard friend. I can. I don't... She doesn't know your name. Okay, I'm in Discord recording Ray's responses. Well, if you heard my my previous deal for her, three stat points, or I remove something very special to you, and something like well, you're a dragonborn. What about something very important to you? Memories. Your greed. Innocence. Why would so you take away something that hurts him? Dragon's greed actually increases their power eventually. I believe. Oh. By the way, did Ernie give you that list I told him to send you? No. Fuck! Code resistance? Hmm. Dude, oh my gosh, you're giving that up. <laughs> oh no. Thinks about it. She thinks about your cold resistance, huh? Hmm. I don't know. That seems cold. You don't encounter cold environments as much as fire. Oh, wait. Oh, I was looking here. Oh, shit. Uh, Ernie's mentioned me about something with Raven. Oh, I was looking here. Ernie. Oh, okay. Ernie's listening and assisting. Gotcha. I guess so. Um, well, he's in voice, so. Yeah. All right. Cool. Um,. Or you just message me what you want to modify that to, um, or if you want to update it, change it off. She changed, she traded her hellish resistance for the bloodline, and a, and a uh, stat point. Ray will take you over the next. I think Ernie just wants to modify the deal a little bit. Sorry. So no book, but she's uh, but everything else is fine. Ernie. Uh, the book should be fine. Yeah. Oh, what? You said no deal, though. Wait, what? No deal for Raven. Cold resistance isn't worth it. Oh, okay, so okay. You get cold so, resistance as part of Okay, so Raven's thing. good. Alright, we're working on Ray. Okay, that's what I thought. I was like, uh, cold resistance isn't really worth it. What about so your cold resistance? <laughs> <laughs> hmm, cold resistance and... Well, I will either... T how about... One stat point. And your code resistance, yes. Are you asking her for more? Just take it if you want. <laughs> I mean, I can take more if you want to offer more. All right, she will shake her hand, Ray. You will lose your cold resistance and you will lose a stat point. Uh, what stat point do you want to lose, Ray? I'll mark it off your sheet for you. Charisma, got it. Yeah, people are getting power buffs. All right. Um, Ray has a minus two to his charisma now. Oh gosh, man. <laughs> and he loses his defense cold. Alright, um, I removed it from your sheet, Ray. 
All right. So Ray, you're good. You got that. Also, Ray, she gives you um a, a new pair of uh, wrappings. She said she was a little unfair last week when you offered up for those. So these give you a D3 fire, uh, damage to D2. When you punch. Yeah. You, you did offer up a, a significant price. I felt like I cheated you a little too much. So I'm going to be fair and give you a D3. Yeah. All right, Ethan. Anyone else? Who's next? <laughs> Anyone and, else? Well, when she says that... You will see a small human looking boy start running away from the cart with something in his hands. Okay, I chase after him. Well, while, as you're chasing after him, the goblin r rolls her eyes, taps the staff twice on the ground, and you will see the boy poof into a bird. I stop running and then hide behind me. <laughs> wait, wait, did Metallo just turn a bird? No, 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 no. The the boy who uh, obviously stole something from her cart turned into a, a bird. She she the goblin would whistle for the bird to come to her, and as she does so, she reaches into her cart and pulls out a silver cage. Which you will see, there's several more birds inside. She's fucking Baba Yaga. She's like, all right, get in the cage. Get in the cage, get bird. Cage. Come on. Oh uh, wait, wait. Okay, that was a child. It was a child. Yes. Like how old was the child? Probably no older than 12, 13. Oh my gosh. Dude, just whack him with a, just whack him with a, just look, just whack him with a stick and turn his head back. You don't need to enslave him as a bird. Nope. Well, I might let him out eventually. Just depends on my mood. How when you see the bird. is actually? <laughs> Turning people into birds against their will? I don't think it's very illegal. Pretty illegal. Nope. She tries, the, the child tries to steal from me. I turn him to a bird. That's justice. I don't care about your laws here. Oh my right, god, I it's I this person. If you turn yourself a into a bird for the boy, I will allow, I will free the boy. So again, you cut out. If you, you turn yourself in for to a bird for the boy, if, if, if you serve his punishment, that's fine with me. So but what's his punishment? Boy. I need a I need a yearly date. Um, whenever I feel like letting him go. Wow. Matt, we found someone who's worse than you! Hey, he's only Shut in the silver up, cage. It's not oh like he's my slave God. forever. <laughs> Sheesh. Uh. Holy shit, holy shit. I mean, just why, why, why the bird cage? Though? Why prison in a different body? Why not just whack? Like, my punishment for legitimate for getting out of your paying you was a whack in the head and pink hair. That seems like it'd yes. be more appropriate for stealing. No, because birds not. are easy to control. You just clip their wings and they never fly away. Dark. She gets it. That was very dark, Lexa. That's dark. <laughs> well. By Whoa. the way, did Alexa manage to annoy the merchant? No, merchant doesn't give two flying birds about the music. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go back up then. Hi, so totally newfound <laughs> respect for you now. Um... <laughs> and you wonder um, why I don't trust you. <laughs> anyways. Yeah, yes. I'm gonna... Okay. Do you have any daggers with special abilities? Just I'm thinking for next week, planning ahead, you know? I, I really like what you, you do here. Do you have something in mind that you want? I do take requests. Um, yes. Uh, just something with consistent damage. It doesn't have to be an enchantment like I get once a day. Just something I could use multiple times with high damage rates. Hmm... I will make something or find something, depending on if yeah. I have it or not. Yeah, right. and it, and if it's in for a cherry on top, returning it, like making it returning or teleporting mm. would just be perfect. But that that's all. Thank you so much for your help today. Thank you for the cape. I'm gonna walk <laughs> right back behind Matt again. Well, you better be ready to trade something worth more to you than that brooch for it. How much <laughs> would a lock of my perfect hair get me? I'm not going to chop it off, I love it too much. But how much would a lock of it get? I would give you a lock of... She points out a random guy in the crowd, a lock of his hair. You're out of your mind. This oh, lady nice. doesn't know that this hair could uh, buy The, the goblin's going to point back toward her dress. Is, is anyone going to help him? He looks like he's drunk, passed out. Wait, seriously? No, is, is, that. is that what happened in character? Yes. Driska's passed out back there uh, behind you all. She just kind of like okay. gestures toward the 
what appears to be a, a passed out drunk dwarf. Oh, what the so fuck? The drunk dwarf. Right, I'm gonna go over. The threads go. What I'm the shit? I'm gonna make medicine check real quick. He's a dwarf. He'll be fine. Can I make a medicine check with advantage? Because I've had experience with drunk people. <laughs> Anybody experience being drugged? <laughs> uh, this is all Ernie stuff right here. So he just messaged me that. <laughs> Someone help me so I can have a 17. <laughs> I'm not proficient I in medicine. Look... Are you proficient in medicine? Um, I am. Okay. I am. Leo's not here. Leo is not here probably till like 10 minutes. We could probably put the clock time on weird, weird ways. We spent um, an hour. Ernie does a. This, all right. Does anyone want to see if he's alive? Maybe. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Is drunkenness the state of being sick? Yes. The does, hangover. Doesn't he have divine yeah. health? No. He's a paladin. He's not. He's level five. Yeah, divine health is level three. But he's immune to poison and stuff, not death. He's, he's dead. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Is he dead? All right. Matt, Matt, Ernie. Matt goes over there and checks his pulse. Is he alive? Oh wait. What the? Read the chat. It I has to do with the ring out of characters we said. Yeah. Uh, Ray, we'll, uh, all of it? Well, we'll require half your blood. Hmm. <laughs> your half your blood's dragon blood. I want the half with the dragon blood. <laughs> want the half with the dragon blood. Give me that blood, y'all. What the hell is going on? Oh, right. <laughs> this is weird, guys. I kind of want to leave. <laughs> Same, but now we have Durska passed out, and a seventeen doesn't wake him up. Ray, sell. Who's who helped you? No one else here is fresh no. medicine. No one is. Oh, he's probably attuning yeah. to the thing right now. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, no. Would you rather um, we do it uh, in here, Ernie, instead of typing it? If you want to pronounce your speech now. Oh, I can do that. Up to you. Whoa. Give me a speech. What? I'm glad you speech. all gathered before me. My name is Dritska, son of Torbing, member yes. of the Daemon clan. Yes. I need your powers, my lords, to grant me my army. So that I can take dominion over the giants and the goblin kin. What the frick? <laughs> Matt just kind of has just has strokes his chin. He's like, hmm. Didn't expect did, wait, that. did he say that in his mind, or did he just? Hold on, it's been... Chris. Hold on. It's in me and Ernie's mind. Oh. Yeah, I was wondering if that said you, um, you said that in your so, like. Dritz, is Dritzka saying that in his mind, or did he just drunkenly pronounce so, that to the entire facet? So, to you guys. I'm passed out. Gotcha. I was oh, just making sure that I'm just making sure that's what the case was. I'm like, yeah, I was not gonna let you finish that sentence. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, I'm passed so out. confused. So in my dream, that's what I'm having. All right, Dritska, there's two words aside from the three words I need you to type down and just note somewhere on your character sheet. Okay. These are dominion. Yep. Vengeance. And leadership. Okay. Three words. All right. Oh God. Yep. Oh, oh God. Welcome to how the rings work. Tenants of his new, yeah, tenants of his new oath. He took uh, the Dominion path, not, didn't he? Yeah, basically. Right he did. Out of character yeah. thing. How will paths work? Paths are related to aspects. Aspects will have one word related to them. In this case, the one before that you've had. Okay, yeah, this is how it's ash. related to the damn tattoo. <laughs> yeah, you have ash. There's the one that the ring are ash, nature, dominion, and inevitability. Alongside that, along. In the first roleplay encounter, I will ask everyone to do who has access to a, who is currently on a path. I will try and get two additional words from the roleplay encounter. What in the world? Path. Think prestige classes, but essentially a path of prestige feats, which will give significant amount of power if you don't end up dying. The chance of dying is quite high if you don't constantly get your image of the aspect to a larger degree. It starts with three words, then it can go to a sentence, a paragraph, a story, etc. You just need to constantly be the same thing. If you change it, you don't. So it's basically like it's basically like that one word game 
Well, it's essentially can... word association, but I'm eventually going to stop asking for the first word that comes to your mind and start asking for the first story that comes to your mind, and eventually start asking for the first civilization that comes to your mind or something like that. <laughs> I can ask anything story. that I want, and if you give me an answer that was different from your initial answer in like thematically, you die. Okay, thematically. Okay. Yeah. I thought it was like you had to repeat and keep adding on the same words again and again. Well, the, yeah. the core idea should always be the same word. So, for any role, so Dritzka, for any role-playing encounter we do based around your path in the future, you should always try and stick with dominion, vengeance, and leadership. If you change, you die. This feels like the baseline testing in. Uh... Gosh, damn it! Can't remember the name. Is it? A, it's a game, right? It's like, also, no, it's it's like that cyberpunk movie with Harrison Ford. Oh, oh, uh, Blade uh, Runner, Blade Runner, the Blade Runner, Runner that's uh, like saying the words. Uh, just just to yeah. back more. <laughs> clarify something. Uh, his speech was not in character, correct? No, that was Our, in the thing. Yeah, yeah, it was in, that was in the magic void. Yeah. All who yeah. just wakes up now. Yep. You okay, know. buddy? Oh, All right. yeah. My head is pounding. Uh... Wait, Tetsuka, you got drunk? You don't smell the hook off my breath. Uh, also, Raven, did you attune to the Ash one? Not yet. She has not. She's not. All right. Oh no. Matt has, oh, Matt has yet to do that with her. Oh. All right. By the way, can I still can I still get in back door on those? Uh, you can. Sweet. But you lose um travel. I... Yeah. You would lose travel as your aspect. Oh, I still have. Wait, I have. I'm on a path. You're not on a path, but if you go on another path, you lose the ability to go on travel. Which shows travel. You only get yours. one. Where the hell is That's travel? How... Where do well, you he gets think? How? The astral plane, probably. Nope. Where do you think? It's on your hand. Oh, okay. So, oh, okay, okay. That's okay. All, all paths are linked to an item. Gotcha. Yeah. Tip so, the scales is the aspect of travel? Weird. Nope. Hold on, Ray. Right, we're, we're getting to you in a second. Hold on a second here. We're trying to figure out other stuff. Sorry. No. Uh, it's not the aspect of travel. It's the, it's the uh, slip between the cracks. Oh. Oh, you're talking about my gauntlet. Okay. The gauntlet, the elf one doesn't give you slip in the cracks. It's a combination between class feature and the tattoo, actually. Oh, okay. Because I had slip in the tracks before the tattoo, though. I know. You right. didn't have access to the path of travel before you had the tattoo. Though. Okay, gotcha. <sighs> All right, this is very weird. There are currently now two characters which are on a path. Soon to be four. Matt's one of them. Matt isn't on a path yet. You haven't had your role yet. Yeah. Yet. Yeah. But you, there's two I'm guessing Raven's going to be. So, so Quin on a path, Quincy and Dritzka? Nope, you're not on a path. Unless you've had specifically had a roleplay encounter and I've asked you to write down three words, you are not on a path. Two yeah. characters which are on a path, three which will... Two which have the potential to be on a path, one which will be on a path in the future. Actually, now I really want to know how to unlock this. <laughs> you also probably want to know who the other character on the path is. Um, well, I'm guessing... Are they here? No. Plot uh, twist, it's me. Screw you. God oh, fucking, fucking course it is. <laughs> Plot twist. Of course it is. Yeah. I also did it through completely legal means. <laughs> <laughs> By DM I, uh, I, Matt, Matt, Matt's like, okay, how can I fuck him over Ernie? I outsmart you. Well, the thing is, Ernie knows the entire universe, so he can can't, can't, can't help not doing it. Yeah. Yeah. But also, Matt, how dare you? aspects, well, paths are the one thing that I sort of can royally fuck up, because Matt's doing my path. So if at any yeah. point Matt feels that I aren't following the three words, I'm dead. Well, also, with, with, with the path, right, you could just randomly go on Conjure and have to do this, correct? Watch uh, my access yes. to the path with the one time I roll a natural one wait, on the D hundred. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> or, or, any, or is it like when you want to like increase the path, you get set on it and then you do this test? Or is it every round? At any point, them? I have the right to knock any person on the path unconscious. I probably will do it during downtime because that makes the most sense. Yeah. But if you're in a situation which emulates your path in a session. I can't have knocked unconscious. Mac also has the same right to do that for my character. And I can do it to everyone else's character, too. Yes, but oh, if you're going to do it, great. message me first and get my commission. Yeah, obviously. All right, I'm, I'm not going to be just like, hey, um, you know, Machalo, fucking do it. And then I'll be like, ah, no, you're here to do it. I can't, I can't do that. So. 
Yeah. Alright, cool. So we're going to continue on with the session. Um, unless you got anything else, Ernie? I'm assuming not. Okay, cool. Um, as everyone's done taking care of Dretska, you all see Matt shaking hands with the goblin. As I make a couple modifications to my stuff. Matt, deal with What'd the you get, buddy? I gave up strength for something else. Ooh. Care to share or, like, in private? Ah, uh, not gonna share. Uh-oh. All right. But I traded strength for skills, I will say that much. Hmm. Nice. Nice. wonder what skill he got. Mm. Hmm. It's something related to what? killing half-elf no. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> I will say this, Matt looks less buff significantly. What was his strength before? I didn't imagine it was buff. 10. It was 10. Yeah, you were buff. That's average. <laughs> no, um... I said, I mean, 10, it, no, 8 is average, actually. If you compare um, D&D strength to IRL strength, 8 is average. Or, yeah. Oh, so much is buff. Okay. I mean, you just have defined muscles. That's all you have. Yeah. Defined. I got abs. Oh, boy. Uh, I mean, let me message Ernie to get a confirmation. So, did Matt literally just turn into a twig? Like, is he fading away? Like, he's halfway to, like, aging into death? So, basically, he has no biceps. It kind of looks more like a twink. <laughs> All straight He up. was already a twink. <laughs> Matt, you look like a real wizard now. Good for you, buddy. Good for you. We need um, to get Ernie, some food, though. Fatten you up. Ernie, I just confer I just, I'm asking confirmation that's a good deal. Or is that a fair trade, I assume? Gunner lifts his shirt up and be like, Man, I got the abs and the backs. <laughs> Straight. Well, because Gulnar finally has his health back. <laughs> wait, wait, what? Yeah, 35 HP now. You can actually take a fucking hit. Gunnar, just, just take the average. Save, save yourself the horrors of rolling a natural fucking Oh, yeah, 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 I hit. took the average. He I... had to take the average. He couldn't re-roll. I, mean, I meant from now on, when you hit level 4. Just just take the average. Just, just be buff, man. Just, just I don't know. I lucked the fuck out my last two rolls. <laughs> I'm at level 4 and 23 hit points. I've been getting really bad luck. Wait, 23? Go fuck me. I'm on 23 right now. <laughs> hey, don't feel bad. Yeah. Like, it'll level up next time. I got a, I got a full 8 on my last one. Ooh. So I'm, I'm at 33 right uh, now. Um, I'm, not a I'm just going to assume right now, it went through and then until Ernie says so otherwise. Um, but um, that's all Matt has. The goblin will look toward everyone. Anyone else have anything? Uh, Gunner's going to come up and... Can we come up with a nickname yes. for you? So we have something to call you? No. Nickname. You can call me Merchant. There's a lot of those that are not very specific. But I'm the you Merchant. You look like a Stella Capital back. M, can Capital you, can I call you that? The Merchant is what you can all call. I don't... We're not calling them the good Merchant, Wick. Maybe the... the maybe... Maybe uh, the Prime Merchant, but not the good Merchant. I like the Prime Merchant. That's good. Or the merchant or of or the you. merchant of Legion, I don't know how many souls I just saw. Ow. Go in there what you want. Does the merchant have to have anything that would help me uh, resist magic or you know, hurt more pe hurt people that ha use magic? You literally just saw her turn a little boy into a bird for stealing. I You still a goblin, so you am still a merchant. And do you wish to never use magic? I've got no problem not using magic. Do you wish for magic to never affect you? Yep. Hmm. I can ensure that magic will never affect you ever. And you will never be able to use magic, though. Ever. Is that every single type of magic in existence? Including healing magic. Including everything. That I'm assuming. But Is still, I mean, like, that's like in Skyrim, when you're at 99%, that's pretty ridiculous. <laughs> I have a ring that I can give you. When you wear it, magic never touches you. That is so... Morals. 
So does that include enchantments on weapons magic, or is that just spells? Everything. Magic, period. No magic can ever touch you or affect you, ever. And you, in turn, can never use magic against anyone. That's a pretty dope thing, bro. I don't know. I don't think it would affect your items, though, because, I don't know. You're not, the magic is imbued in the weapon, it's not imbued in you. Yeah, the, yeah no, but that's almost like he walked through chain lightning, unaffected. Like, that's yeah. ridiculous. <laughs> But also, like, it means he can't. But also, but also, <laughs> also it means, means he I... can't have healing potions. Yes. No, I can have healing potions. Those aren't magic. They are. Yes, magic. they are. Alchemy is a type of magic, isn't it? Mm, it's just no. plants and herbs. Yeah. Herbalism kit should still be used in Atlas. Okay. Well, he can use potions, but no healing magic. So, Leo's out. To be fair, Crow was like that, but Gunner, like, if you can, you, can, can Gunner, like, survive a fireball with no damage? Is that the level of anti magic here? Well, what do you say, my big muscly friend? Oh god. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> however, <laughs> I'm going to make it to where you can never remove this item. Oh, do it. <laughs> do it. I'm, I'm all for it. <laughs> Even if you chop his hand off? Eh, if you chop his hand off, then yeah, obviously he loses it. Alright, okay, we're good. Yeah, and we got an out too. Not even the hand. Just chop off the finger. This is great. Right. Um, one minute, Ernie is helping me make this one. Also, as the merchant offers the item, I'm doing this for all the players. Just freak you all the fuck out. Wait, you would see it? that the item resembles a very bland, very plain grey band of metal. PTSD. PTSD. Oh There's fuck! It's grey. Damn right it is. You you can't tell him that, though. No one knows about it. I do, I fucking met the asshole! But you don't know this thing is related to him, though. It's just great metal. Swag. Can I make you an intelligence swag. check based on that? Nope. Quincy, Quincy, Quincy. <sighs> Only person who has you. ever saw an item from Grey was Matt. Damn right it was. <laughs> I feel like if I saw Grey himself, I could feel a bit of his presence on a ring. Can you feel nothing this? Kinda. Alright, Ernie, um... The difference between oxygen and nitrogen in the air with your bare hand. Not your bare <laughs> hand! But you can actually tell- I think you can tell that when you breathe in if you enter a room with more nitrogen. No, 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 no. I'm not talking about air that's only oxygen and air that's only nitrogen. I mean air, the stuff that you're breathing right now, and trying to distinguish between oxygen particle and nitrogen particle by moving your hand. Oh! <laughs> that, that's how hard it is. Not yet! Anyways, uh, Gunnar, I'm assuming you're getting it. Yep. Uh, I have to type it up. All right, so or, or, yeah, Ernie's gonna type it up. Um, Gunnar, you do get that deal. Um, all right, everyone else, anything else? Are we free to move on with this session? Let's go. We spent a lot Going of time Going once, here. only an hour. Going twice. That's a lot of time for a session. <laughs> we spent an Cold. hour. Yeah. I can't wait till <laughs> next week. It's awesome. This is awesome. Let's just hope Matt made a more balanced encounter so we don't spend four hours fighting it and dying. You I all would don't head have toward work today. I'm good. You, you all would head toward the docks. Um, you would see a small ship, um, similar to the one you guys rode in last time there. Um, you would not see the uh, Minotaur. Um, as you do get there, uh, Matt would tell us we don't have a get out of jail free button this time. So you guys will have to meet him back at the edge of the facet uh, to leave. Oh, great. Perfect. That sounds fantastic. Let's go. Yeah. So you would all get on the ship. Matt would put his hands on the giant magic orb to power it. Um, and all of you go um, head off toward the set. A couple hours of flying later, you arrive uh, near the same area as you guys got there last time. Um, and you would all hop off. Matt would kind of putt putt like maybe a mile off the edge just to stay safe um, you know because you don't want the shit your only way to escape the facet you don't want it to get destroyed uh matt just says like signal him somehow or do something to um you know get him back he'll be watching for you guys let's go give you a sending stone oh yeah we have those fuck yeah all right oh, don't they work only like five feet though for one for, oh the new ones i, I haven't I finished the new map I can talk I'm... to Sandler from anywhere. 
Yeah, oh, I don't have the uh, new map finished yet, so we're going to use this one for the session. Next next week, though, the new map will be ready. I um, mean, you're not going to and... be looking at this one for very long. So it does its job. It does its job. Yeah. So I don't. Anyways, we brought vials, right? I don't know. What'd you guys bring? I don't have it. It's not on your character sheet. You don't have it. Oh shit! Even the empty potion bottle. I mean, if you want to use the empty potion bottle, you're more than welcome to. Sweet. I got like four of those. I got the empty potion. Is it on your character sheet? Well, it will be on if I use a healing potion. <laughs> All right, there you go. Yeah, if you use a healing potion, then you're fine. But yeah. anyways, that reminds me. Uh, okay. <laughs> I did put that in on here, right? Nope, I did not. Since Leo's not here, um, as we can get up boarding the land, um, I'll take ten minutes doing my casting. Uh, is it under player player owned, Ernie? Uh, what's it under? Oh, tier five. Okay. Oh, I see. Gotcha. Gunna may have one of the most strongest situational magic items. Um, this this is camera. this is fucking good. I'm not gonna lie. Um, I want the, <laughs> the crossbow or the gray item. The, the, the ring. Yeah. Dude, Literally. like, I can't one-shot him now. Actually, no, yes, I can. It's acid. I can still kill you. He's, He's immune. It. It's a magic dagger. Gunner is immune to, ev like, nearly every magic, so I can't, I can't, I can't hurt him now, can I, Ernie? I can't even touch Gunner if I had a fight with him, correct? Your thing's not magic, you're psychic. That's in good. We had a whole debate about this the other day. <laughs> no, I get three attacks. I'm just gonna throw three acid vials at him. With sneak attack and surprise. Oh, I'm fine. Okay. All right. So you all arrive. Yeah, he's immune to Quincy's stuff apparently. So uh, my, you all arrive. At wait, my soul the, uh, magic? Yeah. Yeah, because if it's if it's magic, period, he, he doesn't hurt him. Uh, anyways. All right. Wait, does it affect or just doesn't hurt? Quincy, can you deal more than fifteen damage in one soul magic attack? Yes. Can you do so without killing yourself? Yes. I have seventeen soul health. Right, so if you sacrifice all 17 soul health, you deal 2 damage to it. Gotcha! Oh my god. <laughs> anyway. If you sacrifice anything less than 15, you would take no damage and you would take full damage. Gotcha. You all arrive on the facet. The same eerie jungle um, colors, or not jungle, the forest colors um, are all before you. Nothing seems different than the last time you were here. I Someone, learn. Quincy, assist me. <laughs> Quincy assist me. If he assists you, he can't stealth yeah. himself. And my stealth's better, so assist me next time. Trick you. <laughs> Dude, literally, my stealth is always gonna be better for, than yours. Fine, fine. Wow! Uh, wow! Trick you. Wow! Trick you. wow! <laughs> it's still yeah, higher. About... <laughs> it's still higher than yours, <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> if you would've assisted still me, I had a 19. Off. Critical fail doesn't mean anything on a check, but still it's fucking failure. Well, I got my two nat ones out of the way. But I see how this day is gonna go. Um, anyone else wants to do anything before you guys start walking off? Um, map with survival check. And someone give me a hand with this so I can start, you know, getting shit done and going places. Does anyone have survival as a skill? I have it as a skill. I'm gonna do... You give me a hand? You got survival as a skill, Gunna? You got survival as a skill, good sir? I got negative one of the wisdom. <laughs> okay, uh, I guess solo survival skill to try and keep everyone on fucking check. Check. Three, two, one, go. Alright. Ooh, I'm nice. I know I'm gonna going. do stealth. Alright, go for stealth. And I get plus two. All right, and I get plus two. two. Oh, wait, are you in the, wait, are we in the light? Uh, it's it's force, so it's partially shadow. Okay. Like, it's. Like, just be careful, because if you use that near light, it'll burn you. I don't think I think that's a dragon thing, not a. Um, she has the same thing. ring, isn't it? Isn't that the shadow thing? I swear. No, no. It's, a, it's a shadow spell. It's not a ring. Oh. Yeah, it's, it's a spectrum spell. It's called shadow. Yeah. Anyways, yeah. um, all right. So if you, all right. So anyone else want to do stealth or survival checks or anything like that? Anyone? Last chance. No. All right. 
Gunnar. All right. Can I make a survival check just for, or you know, you I made already a made a stealth. Yeah, stealth I already made a stealth. Yeah, I already made a check. Okay. You made the worst right. stealth imaginable. All right. So everyone, um, go ahead. Whoever wants to lead the way, you may start walking. All right. So what, Dretska, what you want? Huh? <laughs> so many people spoke at once. Threads, Anyways, go ahead. do you want to head out, out to the front? What, Dretska? Why are you muted? I think okay. Dretska's apparently away from keyboard. Okay. Uh, question, guys. How long do you think we'll walk before we need to do what we're doing? Uh, I don't even know what the fuck we're doing. Matt told us Jack shit. He dropped us off here and then fled ran away. No one well, asked me. You're Let's the lead. Continue. You're supposed to be leading. Here's the thing. I didn't actually hear what, what Matt was saying about the mission because everything in the background. So. I do not physically know what has actually Grab the sending here. stone! Matt, what the fuck are we supposed to be doing here? The same thing you were doing here last time. Oh, it's just more exploring. Let's go the opposite uh, direction since it's a different direction. So, different like, way. more than an hour or, like, less than an hour? Wait, Matt. Wait, wait. Matt, are we the only team here? You don't know. No, Matt, do you know? <laughs> oh, I don't know. Yeah, we're talking over the sending stone. It's a group call right now. I forgot, yeah. Yep, I have no clue. Hmm. Let's right, just walk the die. opposite direction to what we did last time for something different. The opposite direction would be off the middle of the facet. We walk towards the mountain. <laughs> well then, let's go. <laughs> Sorry, Haven, what but that's like that. that. Let's. You mean go this way? Let's, yes. Let's head. How about we head on the outside? How about we stay near the outskirts this time? Well, okay, 20, 20, 24 miles heading this way should be Gucci because we went this way last time. Let's go that way. Uh, no you, way. Went, you went counterclockwise no, we... last time. Yeah. So go that way. You, you went, went this way last time. So yeah, so we're going go let's go this way. way. And let's head towards the, the weird lake area. We, how far do you try to travel in a day? Uh, 24. 24. Yep, um, I'll move my... Okay, I'm holding it 24, 24 miles, so I'll move the token. That's one day worth of travel. There we go. Yeah. So, um, the first day of travel, you don't encounter anything, really. No even tiny ass chimeras? Nope, no, no, no chimeras, nothing. You do see, like, birds that have, like, turtle shells on them, in trees every now and then. You'll see rabbits with, um... Did you literally make turtle no. doves? Yes, I did. Um, <laughs> you will see chipmunks, but that seem to be crossed with rabbits. Aww. Things like that, is you know, it, typ typical it... forest animals that are crossed with other forest animals. It's just an island of the Avatar series. Guys, am I on acid? I mean, did so you, you guys... lick your dagger? What? Did you lick your dagger? No. Then you're not on acid. Do right. you want to lick it? No. You guys set up camp. Okay, good. You guys set up camp, you do your night watches and everything, nothing happens. And then you travel for the next day. Next day, 24 miles, so I'm in the fucking token yeet. <laughs> Alright, as you guys are traveling on the second day, you do see in the distance a tower overgrown with vegetation. Ooh. Okay, whispering. Do you guys want to investigate that? Not particularly. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Alright, so I'm gonna. Looks like okay, I'm... fine. I'm gonna say to everyone hey guys, I'm gonna go in the bushes and stealth. But as I, once I'm like out of their sight, I'm gonna turn invisible. That's my first charge. It lasts for an hour. Yep, there goes my clothes. Bye bye. I want to see if he turns invisible. You can't <laughs> see me. I'm invisible. I'm watching. <laughs> no, I'm saying I want to watch you while you walk away. He. Okay, okay. To do that, you have to actively probably follow him as he's walking off. Okay. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I literally walk <laughs> into the bush. Okay, right. Quincy, why are you following me? Leave me alone. Machado is <laughs> invisible. Stop. And uh, going, <laughs> I mean, you can't see him, Quincy, so it doesn't matter. Um, no, I'm just asking. Could I? Could I? Could I was asking, could I have followed him? No, you couldn't. Oh, okay. Invisible. Quincy, Quincy. Um, anyways, anyways. He turns yeah. invisible. You just think he's still thing really good. Yeah, so, that's yeah. What was the point of it. <sighs> anyways, um, you guys head off toward the uh, tower, and you realize it's not a tower at all. It looks like a crumbled keep. And I will take you to a map. You were not on there for long, were we? Oh, Makalo, you're back! Machalo! Shut up. No, that's my invisible form. You still can't see me. 
<laughs> wait, so wait, you're invisible? Oh my god. I stop. That, okay. How yeah. many times do I have to tell you? If look for the accent. If the accent is not there. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I've told the same thing to Matt like five times. <laughs> Raven, don't run up yet. I'm not ready. Yeah, no, <laughs> don't don't remember, never <laughs> move on the map. What you see on the map is what you see in person. So you guys have free availability to do whatever you want. Oh. Alright. I'm gonna look at the well. All right. Is that you look a well? at the well. It is a well. Hey. You would look into the well, and you would see a very long, dark blackness. Deep blackness, I okay. should say. Is this oh, Quincy! Oh, hold on! Everyone okay. stop, please! Quincy, back up a couple square. Okay. I was looking to look... Nope. Is that a trap door? Right there. Yeah. Uh, well, no, that's on top. You're on the bottom floor right now. Yeah. yeah. Um, but you do see right here is an opening. And as you step in to get closer... Hold on one second. Of course. Can I do this cautiously? <laughs> You didn't say it, it's too late. Because I was trying to move here and I moved too far. It doesn't matter, you already moved there. Please move back. <laughs> oh my fucking no 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 Thank you. Are those fucking basilisks? Or no cockatrices. What you do need oh. to make a saving throw as you look in there, please. Oh wait. Oh demon version Chris is right. Alright, cool. Wait, which Chris? Me. I'm Chris. <laughs> Uh, only one Chris to rule them all. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> all right. What saving throw? I'm looking it up. Hold on one second, please. Uh, you need to make a Constitution saving throw, please. Okay. And you have disadvantage because there's two people looking. All righty then. Thank you very much. Okay. What the hell just happened? Uh, the fail save. You are you cannot move and you feel your body slowly turning to stone plus 10 i'm going to put use one on lexa and one on rankar all right you are no longer doing it you make your save yeah and then we start getting into initiative all right they're fucking they're fucking basilisks aren't they okay are these things like these things that okay it's like three things thinking in my head right now these things that are and each of them all scarily bad and there's two of them. Fuck. Because note, he said two people were watching, so the stone things at disadvantage. Is this like sight based sight based game fuckery? Wait, wait, wait. Where did they pop oh, out of? Uh, they're in. There's. I told you there's a opening right here. Yeah, but like the op they're okay, they're inside the room. Yes. Okay, that's like I thought they were on the roof. That's why I was confused. No. Oh, I actually rolled pretty good initiative compared to you guys. Uh, I'll try to get mine going one second. <laughs> Shit, we all rode shit for initiative. No, Except for Rankar. Are you sure about that? The guy with initiative rolls the fucking Matt 20. It's a frick Rankar. I rolled a Matt 20 for investigating a non magical crossbow, and I rolled a natural 20 on initiative. You know that means like, everything else you're gonna roll today is gonna be like a Nat 1, right? All my stuff is, spells, is, is saving throws, so they're gonna roll natural 20s. <laughs> Okay. Uh, you, should, you, should, you, should, you should have seen Crow's luck gunner. Crow was like, oh look, okay. I'm gonna hit this weakened target. These AC thirteen, rolls a seven, rolls a seven, rolls okay. a seven. When you get a chance, Matt, I need a little Yeah, hold on a second, I'm setting everything up. I gotta roll for their initiatives. Question, can I was this Oh shit. Does that mean doesn't that mean he skips around? No. No, just just one. Left, not in the timeline. Okay. Uh, okay, cool. Sweet. Alright, everyone has their initiative rolled? <sighs> Alright, Ernie's typing, I'm gonna say what he says real quick. Uh, Dritska, you said wait, what, what's up with you, Dritska? Uh, I just get my little minion dude, my little zombie. Ah, uh, yes, let me get that for you. You are able to control it. Yep. Wait, there's a chance he wouldn't be able to? <laughs> there always is. Alright. Um, so everyone will see Quincy. You see him freeze for half a second and then starts moving. Um, you probably said something like, oh shit. Yeah. So I'll go, Holy fuck, there's paralyzing snakes in here! That's more than six words, but we'll go with it. Um, <laughs> you can say more than six words in six seconds. <laughs> Rankar! 
Okay, I didn't think I didn't I didn't think you finished. Sorry, um, I'm just gonna, just gonna see this one here. I, I can see this one here definitely, right? Pull that one there. I can see them. Uh, They're in so the hold room. A Where you are at, you can. They're in they, a room. They have um, three quarters they cover. Have... Oh, does that matter? Does it matter to me? Roll and tell it to save me through. I can see him. <laughs> oh, no. oh, okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that's that's yes. fair. My thing. Uh, that one left. This one. The one on the left? Alright, what am I rolling? Um, intelligent saving throw. Uh, this cool. one with. is... Let me do this. This will make my life so much easy. Mate, I, I, got, I, got, I, got, I got to give them the name tag so I know which number they are. Hold on a second here. Alright, so this is on the left. Uh, that is yeah. this one. Wisdom saving throw, you said? Or intelligence? intelligence. That is a fail. It takes okay, so what happens? It takes 16 damage. Alright. I'll quickly post. Take 16 damage and I'll post a spell here. It can it can no longer take. Um, you can use the action to dodge, disengage, or hide. It can no longer right. attack my turn. Cool. Quincy, it's the start of your turn. Please give me another constitution saving throw. I haven't finished. I was gonna yeah. move. Oh. Oh, apologies. Yeah. Alright. You gonna move? I've stopped looking the instant I saw them. Yeah, I stopped looking at this until I saw them. Wouldn't I be able to like, go run away? Uh, no, it's the, uh... If a creature starts to turn within 30 feet of the creature, and the two of you can see each other, uh... I closed my it, eyes when I saw that happening. I you di didn't say that. Yes, I fucking did! Check the recording! <laughs> it's the start of your turn. I closed my eyes in panic when I turned around and shouted at everybody. All right, all right. You do have your eyes closed. Your eyes are closed. You can't see. Oh okay. yeah. You do. Run the fuck away. <laughs> all right. I'm gonna... Give me a acrobatics check. To run. With your eyes With closed. With your eyes closed. Okay. DC ten. I'm gonna say. Yeah, I was gonna. I was gonna do something like that. Okay. Yeah. Ac acrobatics check, Quincy. All right, you're fine. Okay, you so. Make it right there. Okay, third. No, wait. How, can I still move my full move speed, or is it had because of acrobatics? No, you fa you pass it. You can move your full move speed. Okay, so dark turn. green is forest, right? Oh no, that was on the big map, but yes. Oh, okay. Can I hide in this area? There is not. You see something to hide behind. Gunnar? No. Okay, bonus action dash. I'm gonna get over here where there seems to be cover with Lexa. Mm-hmm. Okay, and then I'm gonna say, okay, and I'm gonna shout out. Wait, can I shout out anymore? You have six words. DON'T FUCKING LOOK AT THEM! Alright. It's this creature's turn. Oh, uh, it's the Eagle Whips. He can only... Dodge, disengage, or hide. Alright, that's fine. He's still gonna come out. Like to just roll initiative. Oh, wait, uh... <laughs> oh. My bad. Lexa, good she choice. would've gone then. Uh... Well, Lexi, you came in late. You didn't realize what was going on, so uh, we're just gonna act like that happened. Yeah. It's like. Uh, oh. Does it only matter if they're, they're looking them in the eye? It said he said within thirty feet. You if you can at them. see each other, yeah. So yeah, uh, so, so they have to be able looking at you. Speed. So this one's gonna flap its wings. Oh damn! They could fly. But they're inside an <laughs> enclosed space. They, they can squeeze them. through. By flapping 20, their wings? Damn. 30. 40. Oh no, this is why I took. <gasps> oh! Goodbye, Quitrid. Goodbye, Wait, Gunner. Gunner, Gunner, you'll be alright. Alright, Gunner. You should be alright now. You should be. Gunner, this is why I ran back. This is why I ran back, guys. I'm the smart one. Alrighty. Uh, <laughs> Machalo. Uh, this is gonna take the dodge action, and it's Machalo's turn. Wait, it's take the creature's taking the dodge? Yeah, because that's all you can do. Okay. Okay. Um, let's see. Okay. Okay. Um, Is that music, close. by the way? I can't hear it. Yeah, there's music. How far away am I from him right now? Can someone draw an arrow, please? Uh, okay, uh, you are... 45 feet away. Oh, 40. 40? 40. From where your character token is. Well, I guess 35 if you count where you're moving. Okay, how about here? That's, that's 30. Yeah. 
That's 30. But you okay. can't see you because you're invisible. Yeah. And then, just planning this out now, I can use a bonus action. Since he said I couldn't use a reaction to close my eyes, can I use my bonus action to close my eyes after I shoot him? You can use your reaction just as the end of your turn, can't you? Yeah. No, because yeah. Ernie said you can't use a reaction. So I just don't... I'm saying No, I'm he said you can. 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 That's why I'm okay. not paralyzed at the moment. Everyone could have done that on my turn as their reaction for that round. Everyone can do that on anyone's turn. Yeah. Close your eyes. So everyone okay, could have so... heard Quincy shout and closed their eyes. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I didn't say that, though, sadly. So um, you open your eyes, good though. Luck. Good luck. Yeah. yeah. Good All right. Well, I do open my eyes. I'm going to fire my crossbow. Good thing it's an I advantage, because... Fumble chart. I have advantage. No, it's advantage. It's no, invisible. Advantage. Oh, it's advantage. That's right. Never mind. Yeah. yeah, so that's 24, and it crits, and I get sneak attack. All right, go for it. Ooh, Wait, is the creature surprised? He's invisible. Yeah. Oh, yeah, okay. I was invisible. Hmm. Okay. Sneak attack, sneak attack. Good thing it already 12. rolled crit for you. <laughs> 12 plus... Um, so 19, it's total 16 plus 6. No, wait, no, because the first one's six. Yeah, so six one's six plus six. six. Oh, 19. Yeah, sorry, 28. Sorry. And then as my bonus action, I'm going to... I can still see, right? Oh, you said you closed your eyes after you shot. Yeah. As a reaction. So if you want to open your eyes again, you're more than welcome to. And if I go to run away, I just have to make an acrobatics check if I go to run. If your eyes are closed, then yes. Okay, then yeah, I'm gonna use bonus action to go behind here, and then I'll make my acrobatics check. Yep. I think it's like one point off die. <laughs> Alright, you're good. Uh, is that your turn, hey, I'm more acrobatics than Quincy. What? Alright, uh, Raven, please give me a constitution saving throw. D did everyone close their eyes or not? Nope, no one said okay. it. I didn't hear anyone. Oh no, I no, said I did. Yeah. No, yeah, you did. No, I, I, I was asking if everyone used the reaction after Quincy shouted. Oh, no, no. I, I'm like, I literally please. just said it on my turn. Plus one. Alrighty, you're good. Damn it. Kill it. Damn it. Hey. Kill it. <laughs> it's like. Yeah, so I'm gonna move closer and going to use this. Ah. Oh. You do miss. Fuck's sake. There's it, so many low rolls today. Is that your turn, Raven? I think Raven took my, my, my sword hit and locked just then. Yeah, yeah, that's my it's turn. Seven. Are you right, going to close your not, eyes? Please give me a con save. Uh, she said that was her turn. Her eyes are still open. You, you, you can use reactions uh, outside of your turn. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. shouldn't should my ring make me immune to its uh, vision? Is uh, it's magic? not a magic, it's an ability. It, it's like a, well... Mm. Is it a magic creature? That's kind of oh, weird. Magically. Um, Ernie, how does that work? Oh, Wait, he didn't even have to attune to the ring. He just gets it. <laughs> he's technically attuned to it, but he can't take it off. By can't yeah, have him yeah, by putting it on, he's attuned. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, is he immune to the, the gaze? Ernie, he's immune to the gaze. Are basilisks mad? I don't know. Basil. Yeah. I would say if you're going to turn someone to stone just by staring at them, that's pretty much a magical gaze. No, monstrosity is not aberration, so it's not a magical effect. All right, so you can make the con save. What the hell it turns you to stone? It's not magic. The DMs have spoken. Nature. Yeah. All right, Gunnar, you yes. are restrained. No, it's not magical because it's technic. No, it is magical. Never mind. Oh, it, it is. Okay, yeah, Gunnar is just fucking immune. It is All right, magical. cool. Good now, you're good. Holy crap. I didn't... Good item buy! <laughs> it is magical because it's technically an animancy effect. Right. Wait a shit! Good now, you want to kill it? Uh, yeah, I'm going to go into a rage first, and then I'm going to slice it icy. You're going to use a like rage? It's almost dead. <laughs> There's another one behind it. I have plenty of use. Oh, damn. Yeah, it hits. <laughs> and it, um, you don't have to roll, it's dead. And one health. God, no. <laughs> one health? Yeah, it did. My child left it at one. I did two, oh, so if I did 29, that would have killed it? <sighs> oh. Yeah. So close. I, uh, Gunnar, is that your turn? You done? Yeah, I'm going to use my movement and I attack. 
All right. Uh, Driska. All right. Seeing that I heard something slither up, but you don't see it because I'm behind a giant shield. Sun, dude in front of me to protect me, and I will take a dodge action as I don't know anything there. All right. Creature number two is slither on out. And he's going to get a little bit more movement. He can move right here. Awesome. Um, Just on top of the corpse. Just eats the corpse. Oh, hold on. Alright, he's going to pick a Gunnar. Or bite, I'm sorry. Does the 10 hit you, Gunnar? No, it does not. Alright, that's his turn. Lexa, you're safe. Lexa. Dodge action. All right. Is that your turn? All right. Lexa turns over. Rencar. All right. To, to, to save um, to save some spell points, I'm gonna try the new crossbow on him. Actually, if I hit anything with it. <laughs> crossbow up. You gotta get up closer, right? right. What's the range on, on a light crossbow? Light crossbow is 80. I'm fine. <laughs> Alright. 80 for 20. I'm not in range of the bullshit power of it. Aim and fire. There's 13, 13 would hit. Yay, yeah, and then damage. I hit with t- fucking 10 damage. Alright. Alright. Wow. And then I'm gonna, <laughs> gonna, gonna move back a bit further. Because they don't like people. Alright. And yeah, that's it. Antisocial. Okay. Quincy. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to see what happens if I. I'm going to use my bonus action for Astral Side to see if it protects from that. Would it if I step out? Uh, to my knowledge, um, Astral Sight only lets you view people's souls. Well, yeah, but I'm saying like it changes my vision from the physical. I need to look at it for it to hit me, right? So I'm. I shot. You cannot utilize Astral Sight. Yeah. Okay, and what about the Animus Armor question? Because you said that protects uh, souls. You said it was more it, effective it, for the Astral Plane. It's the same question of does wearing armor affect your AC? Not AC, uh, but it's the same with yours. Okay, it is? Gotcha. No, it's not. No. It's not? The armor not effective. No, 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 I, I said that, I meant it is in, it's in the same question. The armor is not effective versus the... the, the effect. Effect. Yeah, gotcha. All right, so, then I'm just going to use my bonus action to stealth. Okay. Okay, first stealth. And then I'm going to pop out real quick. Mm-hmm. And I'm just going to shoot it. All right, shoot it. Yeah. 13 hits. I get my sneak, 13 does hit. Get my sneak attack damage. And then I'm going right. to use the rest of my movement to get back in here. So it can't see me. All right, that's, that's <laughs> fair. Yeah. Wait, what's the range on a hand crossbow again? I thought it was 30. It is 30 feet. That's how far away I am. Oh, okay. Sorry, sorry. Alright, uh, Machalo. Okay. I'm going to run up. Hello. <laughs> bye bye. That's Hello, 30. Bye bye. 30. Uh, can I get a clear? I can't get a clear shot from here, right? Or can I hit the edge of it? Uh, how far away are you? Uh, five. Oh, I s- Yeah, I see what you're talking about. Yeah, you can- you can hit the edge, you're fine. Okay, cool. Um... So I do that... That hits. Oh. What did you do, Ernie? Oh, I see. Get- well, Machalo just took it out. Yep. Yep. It is dead. And as it dies, combat is over, and that's what happens. Well, wait, did half the screen just cut off for anyone else? No. Yeah, um, just reload it. Okay. Um, but as it dies, you guys do get like a a Quincy. What? You get like a like on a scale of one to ten, you get a eleven for a danger signal right now. 
Okay. What the shit is this place? And I you pissed off mommy. We're uh we gotta get out of here. Guys, we gotta go. We gotta run. I'm pretty sure those were babies. There's a bigger one. You better. <laughs> Dretska, I Dretska, mean... Dretska, Dretska, Dretska. I know you can raise Gunner? the dead. Sorry, oh, that's that's Gunnar? Is that Gunnar? Gunnar? Wait, actually, yeah, you're immune to this shit. I'm immune to it. <laughs> Gunnar's like, frick life, guys. I'm good. Oh, shit. We have. <laughs> Wait, if Gunnar's immune to this shit, this might actually work. But I. But Gunnar, Gunnar. I still say we found a trap. He's immune to be being fucking shredded yeah. by a bigger creature. Also, don't you have an extra attack as a berserker, Gunnar? I have polar mastery and also have frenzy, so yes. Yeah. Oh, you didn't go into frenzy rage. You just went into normal rage. Yeah. Okay. But, well, uh, you did say danger meter me. going off, so I'm gonna try to stealth again. <sighs> All right. I, this place is giving me the heebie-jeebies. Anyone want to do anything with the dead bodies? Oh come on. Well, I'm trying to harvest the, well, uh, of course I'm gonna, I'm gonna preserve the bodies. So ah, well, before <coughs> you do that... <laughs> fucking no, no. stealthing. Matt, Matt, Quincy, you get back there. I'm stealthing. <laughs> Matt, you get back over there near those bodies. <laughs> get your butt over there. I saw you. <laughs> Fuck, fine, I'm fine. Go <laughs> what the shit? Hold on. <laughs> get your butt back there. Uh, all of you would see... But as before Dretzka could even touch the bodies, a giant 30 foot tall, 10 foot wide sword will become sticking out that would just land, so appear right oh. between you and the bodies. Oh, yeah, like, a, okay, freak? appear as in, like, strike down in the heavens or just, no, like. Appear as in appear. Like, manifest, okay. Is it yes. physical? Uh, does it look. It looks physical. What the fuck? It's the fuck. Ah. It's the fucking drow, isn't it? Uh, well, you would see a drow sitting on top of the, um, pommel. Oh, no, <laughs> I'm gonna shoot no, this no, fucking. No, 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 ah. no. Hello again, Mr. Bubblegum. He would wave. It's like, ah, thank you for getting these for me. I've been wanting some. Sure. Hold on a second here. By the way, do you have an aunt or uncle? They're all dead, but yeah. I think one told me to say hi to you. I doubt it. <laughs> I don't know. Merchant seems to be gathering souls. Hmm. Yes, speaking of souls, you and your belongings are qu shine quite brightly, Quincy. Oh, great. It's gonna make stealth a bit hard. Mm. You can't hide from me. Wait, okay, are you saying this because I have a stealth check or is this a different thing? Like I'm, I'm, I'm sure if this like check. I'm under, okay I'm unsure I'm unsure if this guy actually has a character relation to me or if Matt's just being pissy. No, it's not. All right, huh. all right. I'm saying this one once and only. I am in DM mode. This I know. Nothing to do with Matt. Please. Gotcha. Sorry, no, Matt. I'm sorry. I meant Matt as in. Okay, I call me, you Matt right. as in like DM Chris. Because if okay. I say Chris, I'm also Chris. It's very confusing. Right. <laughs> everyone it, calls me Quincy. Well, anyways, everyone calls me Quincy out of characters, so it's just habit. <laughs> anyways, continue on. Um, yeah, okay. He's just sitting there. It's like yep. <sighs> Uh, okay, uh, do you actually have a name? I do. May we have it, or is Mr. Bubblegum fine with you? You can call me whatever you want. I mean, okay, I whatever you want. Cool, alright. Okay. Well, I don't think we're getting these basilisks. Ran cars, not fidgeting. <laughs> mm, uh, I mean, you can have them, but I can, tra I can trade for them. Oh, God. Look, no, you can have the basilisk. We won't trade anything. What's we've had we've had about enough trading for today. Trust well, us. Well, I also have two other things that you might be interested in. He pulls out a leather book. See, I found this here earlier that you might be interested in, and I will give you a free piece of information on top of it all if you do the trade. Although he kind of looks to the west, got about eh, ten, maybe twelve minutes before I do have to go. All What's right. the trade? Ah, well, see, someone here has something I want. If you offer it up, you all get a what? chance to live, and I get what I want. What What do you want? Ah, see, that would be telling. You have to guess. That's the fun part. Okay, can, you can we have a hint? That's the... You already had your hint. Quincy I, I fucking have it. 
Great. You want your glove, Quincy. <laughs> you want the tyrant gauntlet. I do not want your gauntlet. Oh, sorry. He wants to fucking chop off my hand, doesn't he? I do not want to chop off your hand. I don't want any body parts. That's gross. But you have to chop off my hand to get that tattoo. I mean, you're but the guy talking the about ridiculous yeah. things. You're on a giant sword right now. Chopping off a hand wouldn't be so ridiculous. You're right, so I do like weapons. Oh, oh fuck you! Sword, <laughs> sword, axe, no! Magical daggers, fuck. things like that. Okay, I'm calling BS that you... I, oh, no. Oh, fuck. Fuck you, so you're either gonna take my fangs or my dagger. Which one are you offering? Neither! Got about nine minutes to make a good choice. Okay, what's in the book? The book? Why well, I found it here. Has to do with this whole entire place. That Minotaur, sir, would find it quite worth your time and money. And also the information inside is quite useful. To you guys, I should say. Hmm. Alright. What if the trade does not want to happen and he doesn't want to do it's the like... trade? And we just get killed by the thing to the west, and you bugger off. I'm sorry, like, I'm trying to... I'm really trying to separate character from player here, but I can't help with the dude... Like, you're just trying to nerf Quincy. Just give him... We don't know, he wants a magic dagger. Give him your plus two dagger. Oh, yeah, that one. Yeah, give him plus two. Do you want... It works on armor with people, though. Do you want... There's only one thing I want that someone here has. What do you offer it? I will come up on my end of the deal. So eight minutes. As he looks over to the west, puts his hand over his eye eyebrows like Okay, I present minutes. I look I present Shell Piercer, the armor piercing yeah. dagger. The uh the soul dagger thing? No, no, the shell piercer, the armor piercing <laughs> dagger, the plus two. Shell breaker. Freaking garbage, man. Hold on a second here. Um I just said is this plus two against armor? Oh my oh, character sheet. Um, yeah. We can't stop pacing by the way the entire time, just saying. Um, he's gonna shake his head, he's like, nope, I don't want that. <sighs> Seven uh, minutes. Fuck. Dude! Fine! No. I bring out Soulthorn. Uh, he would hop off his sword. He would hold his hand out. May I have it, please? Book first. He would hold the book out evenly um, spaced, so if you put the dagger in his hand, you could also grab the book with your other hand equal distance. Can we make sure the book's not fake? You have my word as a drow and as an animancer that is not fake. As a drow, your word is. Oh my fucking god! I finally found a different another one. Mm. Say, Our animancer is very different, Quincy, though it comes from the same source. And you would see the sword would just disappear after a minute or so. Oh or fuck, minute, he's on the assault second. he's on the assault but what the shit? Did everyone just disappear on your screens? No, I think it's got twenty no. bucks right now, just refresh your page. I've recorded. I've replaced them with beans. <laughs> yeah, I if like... it makes any difference, yeah. if you don't do this, I will I basically you're also paying me off to not hope hold a deal I made with someone else. If it that and he like looks to the west five minutes. Fine! I like I switch the dagger and like I do the thing where you take one hand on one side, and then I switch the dagger, put it in his hand, and I take the book. All right, he has the dagger. He says, "Thank you very much." Now for that piece of information, he wants her. He points at Raven, and then disappears. What the what? shit? Who wants her? Who wants her? Wait a second. Wait a second. See, that's why I'm pissed off. I made sure this is Matt just being mad I can kill him instantly. <laughs> Do keep in mind, Ernie, help me make this session. I'm, that's all I'm gonna say. Oh god. <laughs> Ernie took away your soul thorn, bro. Now, Matt. Soul thorn is gone. Matt's did it. Well, <sighs> Matt doesn't know. Yeah. Well, that's good. But Matt, dude, Matt never knew. No one fucking knew about soul thorn until today. Literally, I've never used it on anybody. Yeah. Um. I, after you finish that statement, um, Raven. Or I actually want to whisper this to you. <laughs> okay. okay. Quincy is looking good. It'll just be looking very concerned and very pissed off. Like that mix of, like, I guess Hulk rage almost at Raven. Raven. 
Raven just looks very so frightened. What the shit? What the shit? You think I'm not? I think someone just neutered Quincy. No, not, it's like Quincy doesn't give a shit at this point. That bomb hey. drop is worse than Soulthorn. <laughs> Amy, I sent you a message. Oh no. On and, what? And, uh, in roll 20. Oh, okay. How the hell do I see that in roll 20? The yellow one, the one in the yellow box. Yeah. The yellow box, it's from me. Man, card's just doing laps right now. Do, do you see Raven it? Raven falls to the ground in pain. What the- What the hell is going on? Okay, it's like, um... <laughs> wait, wait. Uh, what just happened? Did... Oh, no, did no, 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 no. What the sh- Wait. Did that thing just heal? Or did Matt just yep. to have the HP go? No, I didn't move the HP. Sorry. Okay, I, uh, I, I, like, I thought it just healed for a second. Like, wait, what the shit? Raven! No. Oh, Raven! May I ask what kind of pain she's in? Um, like the dreadful mental pain of, oh shit. <sighs> oh, oh, so this is like it's a like, stress thing. So she's like clutching her head. Yeah. 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 Uh... It's like, wait, like, is she clutching her head, like, collapsing the ground? Yeah, she's, she would have fallen to her knees okay, and she's like, gripping her head. Like, Quincy, it's like, Raven, what, what's going on? What's going on? Oh, Dad, what's going my on? Head is, my head is pounding. I don't know. <sighs> Fuck. Why does Leone actually need him? Where? Wick! Get over here! <laughs> Already mind link to Raven. Do I see anything doing a pokey poke in the head head? You see a pair of eyes looking at you. <laughs> I cut the connection. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Nope, nope, Wick, you I just am... got attached, man. I am not going back in there. No, no. Can you send me in? <laughs> Fuck that. I'm not taking you. In <laughs> no, you don't take me. Just send me. I can't. That's not how it works. I have to be a conduit for this. What the I'm shit not... is this guy doing? You hear um someone clear the throat. <clears throat> Hello. Oh fucking what now? I'm oh, sorry, well, sir. We just, just stressful situation. I'm sorry. Uh, no, no. Actually, I can help. I can answer questions. I'm here for the Cambian, and you'll point toward where Raven's on the ground. The oh way. fuck you! What? Fuck you, DM Matt. Wait, what does Cambian mean? <laughs> Raven's about to get wings. Huh? Oh crap. <laughs> okay. Fuck you, DM Ernie. You're turning her into a goddamn Cambian. It's a literally a monster in the monster manual. Wait, wait. <laughs> I'm looking that up now. Wait, no, no. Yeah. yeah. Your daddy sends his regards, by the way. Oh, oh sir. No. This, sir. Wait, 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 wait. What? Not hmm? the cat. No, 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 no. So, oh, if the rest of you are all free to go, I'm here for the Cambion, and I need to get going. I want to get my blood. All good, good and go. Stepping between Raven and this guy. Where is this guy, by the way? He's right here. He's up on the it's like, ledge. I could barely, I could not see him, sorry. It's like, sir, if she's not going with you willingly, then you're going to have to go through all of us first. Matt, just a quick mm. note. Sorry, yeah. Chris, just a quick note. I am preparing a surprise if I see him do anything threatening to them. Oh, that's fine. Go okay. for it. Yeah. Yep, just preparing. Just if I see any listen, hostile. Listen, I'm, I'm, listen. I'm not paid to kill you guys, hurt you guys, or anything to you all. I'm here for the Cambion. Her Daddy name wants his daughter back. Is Raven. I don't care what her name is. I'm not paid for names. Then you can take them here. How much would it cost for you to take us with you to our daddy? <clears throat> for free. It's free to I go. Mean, as long as I, as long as I get to take her with me, yeah. No, 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 no. Guys? No, 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 no. <laughs> I don't, I'm not I saying don't. this in character, but please, no. <laughs> okay, I'm not letting- I am not letting him take Raven anywhere in character. <laughs> okay, I'm okay. okay. So I'm saying we fight and kill this guy. We don't go wait, with him. Wait, how much did he- first question, how much did, did Raven's dad pay you? He paid me in a whole bunch of infernal blood. Uh, okay, that's. I guess that's expensive. What if I told right. you I knew a guy who could provide you with almost more infernal blood? Oh, well, if you can outpay him, then I'm willing to. On our ship, there's a man list. named Matthew Azure Magic. <laughs> oh, You're not. No. 
Well, you want to point me in the direction? Is he? What is he, a demon lord? Oh, no, he just has a devil bloodline, and something apparently happened, happened at an orgy, and he got a lot more dickish. Hmm. So you're willing to sacrifice some random dude that you don't know? Oh, no, I've known him, I've known him for about three years. Oh, okay. So which way is he? Oh, my it's God. It's like... Oh, you're did you not see the giant... Did, not. did you not see the giant sword that just happened? Oh, yeah, I paid him, too. He's, he's helping me. Ah, fuck! Yeah. I was gonna set them up against each other! Well, that plan got shelled. <sighs> okay, is her dad in hell? Guys, are we gonna fight this thing or what? <laughs> everyone, everyone, no. get close. His dad, the dad is in hell, yes. Everyone, get, everyone, get close right now. I'd take two acid, two vials of acid out and prepare. <laughs> seriously, okay, seriously, trust me. Everyone just get close right now. Quincy, well, I'm, body, so I'm, not... I'm not losing surprise. <laughs> no! Don't... You're still invisible. We're not going. Dude, I'm we're... not invisible. We're not gonna fight this fucker. You can use it twice a day, can't you? I'm, I'm gonna put in Thieves Cant, Makalo. I, I we're... Still... I'm putting in Thieves right, Cant, like, Makalo. Trust me, I'm getting us out of here. We can't kill him. Fine. Fine. Okay, just can right. everyone <laughs> gather around Quincy, please? This better work. <laughs> <laughs> Raven, check, check, check this code. Okay. I did. Um, There's God. Hmm. You're also Watch protected him. of your friend. I just zoomed oh. us to the astral plane. Everybody left. All right, everyone Damn. except for Gunnar is um. Ah oh, fuck. Also. Oh, fuck. oh also ready? Quincy, as you zoom everyone to the astral plane, all of you suddenly now have zero feet of movement speed. What? Oh, Rick, what the you. shit? How? You're carrying them. Oh, oh yeah. Space. I'm oh, carrying them? Alright. Technically. I think yeah. so. Is that correct, Ernie? Yeah. Uh, two things. First, I could have carrying them. Oh. When you're doing five feet, you complete the remaining five feet, it's taken by the guy's ability. Alright. Um, uh, oh, oh, yeah. We'll get back to you in a second. Um, but Quincy, you would see the drow floating there next to you. Just waves. It's like I give him a polite wave back. You got a lot of baggage. Yeah, it's kinda hard. We the thing is your highly guy showed up like two minutes after you. Yeah, yeah, he paid me if you popped here that was supposed to kill you, but you paid me off, so I'm not gonna do that now. Oh great, so he knows about my shit. Well, because I told him Quincy, I could have done him twelve D six damage. Dude, I am pretty sure turn. dude, I am pretty sure this guy probably has at least this guy could probably one shot every one of us at once. Um Gunnar. Yeah, um, the, the bounty hunter just kind of like you wouldn't be able waves to at you. Um, he just pop down, help him like stand like he just ignores you, kind of Gunnar. Um, he just sits right here where Quincy disappeared, just sits there and just waits with his hands in front of him, waiting for him to pop back as if he's expecting them to very shortly. Oh. <laughs> I'm going to carry us all the way back to the astral plane to as far as I can get close to the ship. Yeah, but you you have zero feet of movement. I thought I had five feet. Let Ernie, does he have five feet? You would have five feet if this guy didn't have one specific class ability. This guy? Yeah. yeah. He, did, he, did, like, he has, like, anchorage, doesn't he? Like, let's go, like, um, salt and magic anchorage. <laughs> like that. Okay. There is a drought floating next to you, though, Quincy. Uh, <sighs> what the <laughs> shit? Oh, come on. What the hell is this guy? Mr. Bubblegum. Oh, he's a drought. Wait, how is the how's the sun not fucking hurting him? Magic contacts. Oh boy. Okay, uh, so here. Okay. This guy floating next to you. All right, guys. Can I admit? Can I? I gotta make a proposal. Can I talk? I can still talk to everyone in the astral plane, right? I believe so. Yes. Yeah. Wait, where are we I was right now? Say Raven's in so much pain she can't talk. We're in oh, the no, fuck. You're, you're fine now. Or, um, you're you're fine now, Raven. But you're fine. Raven's oh, fine. it's just a physical you're thing. In, you're on a different plane of existence. He can't touch yeah. you with his. It's like I can't even move with my 16 strength. I'm Atlas here, and I can't move. Um, um, quick question. Um, only question. Only question. Only question. Um, hey, that ring. The instrument time is how long? The question. What ring? The mine ring. Mine ring. Yeah. Long rest. Okay, never mind, that plan's gonna fail. Alright, alright. Okay, okay. Look, here's my plan. I am going to drop 
you, everyone, but Raven back. I'm going to take Raven to the ship, and then I'm going to come back, and we're going to get, because he's here for her. And then I'm going to get the rest of you out of here. And I just realized I can't fucking touch Gunnar for some reason. I'm getting us that damn ring. Did everyone agree to the plan? I feel like this is a terrible plan. I think we should bring her back to the man. Why, Tritska? I have a feeling this numbers. person's not going to stop looking for me since it's my father. I know, but do you really? But, okay. I'm the last person who wants to go back there, but I don't want any of you hurt for it. I'll go back with you. I have no problem. Same, but Raven, I don't trust that we... This guy looks really strong, okay? Well, he said you can all come with. Do you I want us to... Anything... Oh, Raven, that's yeah. literally hell. And you were th you've told me stories. I don't know if we're all strong enough for oh, hell or not. I'll just go. Okay. Fuck I it, we're going. going to stay. No. I am not going to hell. Hell is inadvisable for living conditions and contract conditions. We'll get scared. We either get killed, scam the shit out of, or thrown into a blood war against infinite amount of demons. Pick your Speak poison there. Gunner is fine. Okay, who wants... Okay, which one of you fuckers wants out right now and just go back and talk to Matt and tell him what the fuck's going on? I will do that. Okay, can I... Can I... I can only have zero feet of movement, but can I literally use my 16 charisma to chuck Makalo to the astral plane? What? No, then forget that if you're just gonna chuck... No, I'm not... I'm asking out of character and I'm gonna just do it. What do you mean by chuck? <laughs> well, because I can't move, but the way the astral plane works is it's just... It's a mirror plane. Is what I've oh, understood yeah, it as. So can I chuck Mikala like with their 60 trait like far away so we like land outside of this guy's view so we can go tell Matt? All you gotta do is put me back on the material plane. I can talk to Matt, Matt. But if you left Mikala in the material plane, how would he get out? I mean the astral plane. Astral plane. No, I'm asking if I can chuck him out of it. Like I can chuck him like through it. Oh yeah. If, if yeah, you can chuck him out of the astral plane onto the material plane. Yeah. yeah but can I like, can I sp get a specific spot with my strength? Can I like choose a spot to open and chuck? Uh, within five feet of where he currently is. Motherfucker, you really want us to t deal with this guy, don't you? I don't. <laughs> it's just that you can chuck him within five feet of where he is. <laughs> Otherwise, you could chuck him normally. Okay, if I see Quincy like looking like he's gonna throw me, I'm gonna just kind of lean back since I can't. <laughs> Um, what are you thinking? Can you not just mind do it? You have to throw him? I don't... Uh, like literally, it. okay, I would like to state, literally, we're all in our astral form souls right now. Half our stats are all flipped around. Wait yeah. a second. Uh, Essentially, your charisma is your strength, your wisdom is your constitution, and your intelligence is your dexterity. So wait, Ooh, so then I'm pretty powerful right now. Wait, <laughs> yeah, we have the, we, I have more strength than you, though. Oh, no, I don't. You, you use X, didn't you? You have 18. Anyways. Yeah, I have 18. Wait. Um, one last question, sorry. Any uh, question? With with my mental stats of, 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 of 16, 14, and 11, can I actually move myself or I can't without a specific item? You can't. Fuck. Yeah, I have 18, 14, and 16. Okay, Raven, are you ready to do this? Are you sure you want to go back? <coughs> it's the only option. Let's kill the body hunter. Well, the drow's floating there. He's like, well, there's another solution to all of this. No, well, no, no, no. what? I could give you a push in the right direction. You help kill? We split the bounty of the infernal blue. No, not kill. I don't feel like killing him. He could easily kill me. Oh, great! I don't feel like dying. See? Oh, no. And, and you wonder why I wanted to fucking run away. <laughs> However, I am willing to push you in a, in a direction you want to go. How far? Can, how hard can you push? Eh... Hard enough to where you'll be far enough away to where you could get back to your ship in time. Okay. Shit. Okay, uh, how the fuck do we give Gunnar a message? Because I can't, like, we're abandoning him pretty much. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he's fine. They really can't affect him. <laughs> so They not... still have, they still have daggers. <laughs> I think the only one that can actually get the message should be Rancor with his uh, psionics. I'm the only one who really affect. Yeah, but I'm stuck in the astral plane right now. Okay. Uh, well, I would really appreciate if you gave us all the push. Is everyone sound good with that? Mm-hmm. Like, mm -hmm. everyone sound good with getting the hell out of here? Yes. All right, all right Mr. Rubblegum. Chuck. Really 
have a choice. You will owe me a favor in the future, though, Squire. You're part of the goddamn Starlight Court. He just grins and just pushes you all. Fuck! It's like, just... We, I mean, I always just imagine we're gonna get, like, shot out of a weird astral cannon. Like, he just had a giant fist, like, punch us to the ground. Um, yeah, so you would all wait. go... F yes. Uh, wait. Sorry. Sorry, if I can. Before we get pushed off, mind shield on, like, on Raven's head. Just mm -hmm. in her head. Mind shield. At the 4 out of 10 defense. Here we go. Yes. <sighs> Ah, um, so, all of you would appear basically a day away from where you were. On the better right. map! We got punched into quality! Yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, so where the flag's at is where um, you guys appear at. So basically a day away. Does anyone see a Machalo on the thing? I'm, on... Still, I'm still hanging out with the bounty hunter, dude. Yeah, that's yeah, what... Yeah. The... Like, well, um, Quincy didn't think about that. He didn't know what the ring did because he wasn't paying attention to the merchant at the time. So, so basically, um, when... At the same time they appear, um, the bounty hunter kind of looks in that direction, and then just goes, "Ah, that fucking bastard." He looks at he gives looks at Gunnar. He just like tips his hat towards you and just walks, starts walking in that direction. <laughs> Gunnar, kill him! Gunnar, kill him! I'm assuming the rest of you are like Matt. Um, get us to the get the ship here! Get the ship here! <laughs> Are we just gonna leave Gunnar here? <laughs> I have a plan. Oh Your plan's plan. stuck. Well, do you have one? No, I'm just saying it's stuck. Well, a plan's better than no plan. Wait, wait. Uh, guys, is Raven's mind isn't getting attacked right now. Correct. She is not. She is perfectly fine. My defense is getting attacked right now. No, no one is being attacked. No mental attacks. Nothing. Okay, that guy's a fucking psionic, isn't he? You don't know. Some sort of, some sort of shit. Okay, we need to get moving now. If we get in line of sight, we are fucked. If he sees us, we are going to get smashed. Wait, line of sight? Most likely, I'm taking the lowest common denominator. He could sense our brain matter okay. from the ex-clones away. Okay, so we, but we need to get Gunnar. I feel like Gunnar can handle himself. <laughs> yes, but we don't leave him on an island full of chimeras for what, a week? Honestly? It may do Gunnar some good, in a very sick way, we can legit come back and pick him up. I'm pretty sure the oh, person who have no reason or just Or he'll be him. more crazy than he is right now. <laughs> this is... Enough... I think Gunnar... Okay, we can circle back around for Gunnar, correct? If we can figure Wait a minute! Him. Can we... Wait. I have an idea. Mm-hmm. <laughs> this island... It's a facet. It's floating. Yeah. Let's park under it. Once we get I'm assuming Alex you guys are heading toward where Matt. Like you. I shouted into the thing. Matt, yes. get the ship! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Matt's Ooh. just sitting there waiting for y'all. He's got like a, a book. He's We're all coming there, panicking like crazy. <laughs> yeah. Does he have like a cup of tea right about now? He does have a cup. Of tea. We knock over the tea in our panic. We spill the tea on Matt's robes. I have, I have mage hand, bitch. All right. Good it's luck. like deck. It's like spell decks. <laughs> spell decks safe. <laughs> Um, okay, Matt, update. Um, Devil Lord wants, mm -hmm. wants, wants, daughter, wants daughter back. Points to Raven. So, mm -hmm. potentially, an astral plane person, potentially. Oh, no, an astral plane person, definitely. He took an ax. Yeah. We saw him in the fucking plane. Yeah, true, okay. So, I person, potentially, um, Raven's mind is mind shooter right now. And for He's some fucking Gunnar. reason, I can't teleport Gunnar. That would be something. Uh, that's. Well, that's something you should talk to him about. So. Well, wait, He's... where is Gunnar? We kind of had, we kind of went in the astral plane, we met him now, and then we got chucked out here before I could go back, we go, uh, went back to get him. I have so no doubt that Gunnar is working with the bounty hunter. you, Quincy, go back and find him, t and tell him to meet us somewhere. That's the I'll plan! Oh, okay, cool. Um, so which way are we going? You're going to stay under the facet. Can we do that without dying? Anyone else got a plan? Um... Uh, uh, Matt, you're the smart it. one. Come on, think of something. <laughs> smart one. Uh, so we we just think he's just keeping a good enough distance away and being signaled again. Give well, me a sending stone. Raven, why don't we just have Quincy teleport back take to Convergence and take Raven? Raven. That would be a good idea. Uh, we can go pick up Gunnar and then we can just put putt back. Sounds good. Because if Gunnar isn't also, also, if Gunnar isn't dead, which I hope he isn't, 
then we won't be most likely won't be killed. I mean, pick up Juno and leave. Okay. You guys I don't okay. see why he would get killed when their main action was Raven. Without Raven there, there's no threat. Like, there's yeah, nothing no, to hide. Well, they know a, you're we, their we, friend, so you're bargaining chips. We, we, we don't we don't know that. We actually don't know that in character. I'm just saying, thinking yeah. the boss is going to get right to someone we care about. Worst case scenario. Alright. No. Oh god, this is going to be terrible for Raven's complex. <laughs> While they're all worried about Raven and talking to Matt, Gritska goes up to Ryoman and says, Beep, beep. Pay, please. Really? Right now? Two, brought back two basilisks. We didn't bring them back. The drow took them. What the fuck? Yeah. That little sword bitch took us to? No, uh, didn't we trade them? Did like... you trade them your sword to keep them? Yeah. <laughs> no, we traded the sword so we could live. Yeah, exactly. So the battle's still there. Yeah, he's no. only taking them if we didn't get do the trade. No, he did the trade with the book. He gave me the dagger. The thing is, I gave him the dagger. He gave us the book and our lives. And information. Matt, confirm, please. Oh, uh, what's going on? Okay, what was... he didn't the didn't uh, Mr. Bubblegum? Didn't he say he was claiming the things we killed? Yes. Oh, they're, they're gone. I mean, but, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Uh, Gun Gunnar, they are still there. If you want to take them. No, Driscoll took them. Oh, no, no, Driscoll, you couldn't take them. I he, stopped you. Little... he stopped you before you could. The sword appearing. Mm. Well, after that, though, Something you know, tells me he's yeah. on the fucking assault well, path, Randomancy. <laughs> well, he was taking talking to the dude who wanted to take Ray. Uh, mm. I mean, to my knowledge, they are still there. Uh, that's okay. what I had planned and what I, I was. Okay, doing, look, so. this is look, Raven. There's a dangerous area. If we get you out of here, danger will cease. They can get Gunnar very quickly, and they can come back to the convergence. So whatever you need to do to get everyone else safe. Then come with me. Is sort of here. Safe. You take Quince. you back to the convergence. They tried you to the con people. Okay. Well, the convergence is quite well defended, though. It has six fucking houses worth of guards. Okay. On yeah. Mean, we're bringing her to the place where all the people live. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, uh, oh shit! I saw the book. Can I meet Ryoman back when you guys fit land? All right, so um, Quincy's running toward the convergence of the National Plane with um, Raven. The rest of you and uh, Matt putt putt to the side of the uh, facet. Um, you all hop off and go find Gunnar. Is um, uh, is you find that guy find me to grab, to grab the corpses, or should I just uh, harvest them now? Well, I mean, Gunnar, the, before they appear, Gunnar, you would see the uh, bodies eventually do just disappear before you have a chance yeah. to do anything. Yeah. Um, so you guys find Gunnar in the keep. He's just sitting there. There's no bounty hunter there. Gunnar, you would see everyone minus Raven and Quincy. Hey, not dead. That's great. That's wonderful. I, um... What do we do now? Go home. Well, you would all hear someone talking on the other side of the wall. Sounds like the bounty hunter. Um, but Chalmers, you, you, you hear what he's saying. They got I away. I can hear him say? Yes, you speak um, Infernal, don't you? I do, yes. Yeah, he's, he says, Sorry, boss, they got away. Bring me my daughter. Oh, frick. <laughs> He says, well, there is a problem. See, one of them can uh, apparently traverse through the astral plane and all that kind of fun stuff. Oh, I'm stealing RP, Quint Ernie? I'm sorry. I mentioned to you earlier, if the Raven's father gets involved, I do the speaking for him. Because oh, fine. Because it's a relevant NPC. I, I misunderstood. I thought you said you wanted this to happen now. What, so how do you want to work can on it? you do a voice, though, Ernie, please? Because that was a really cool voice Matt did. <laughs> yeah, I can't do that voice. All right, you so, do what so I can do. do. Hold on. Like Give me two minutes. All right, Rick track just a red track ever so slightly. The bounty hunter says, "I'm sorry, they got away." Okay, I'm hiding. Okay. Did you guys take a long rest or just? Okay. Not yet. Okay. By the way, I, me and Raven are waiting by the docks. I'm reading that fucking book in the meantime. Yeah, I'll um I'll give you the book. Hold on one second. Okay. This is a weird session. <laughs> I mean, I didn't, the thing is, like, I didn't expect Matt's session to have plot. That's where, you're, that's where you messed up. 
Well, dude, you're, I didn't expect you to be Codium, as in, oh, I earnestly I'm giving you all the endgame material. It's kind of cool, though. Uh, we haven't had, like, a heavy plot session. There's your book, uh, Quincy. Uh, wait, what about the information on the aisle? On what? The aisle. You said the... the did the Bubblegum just lie to me about the book about the aisle? The oh, island, uh, you mean? Okay. The oh, is this, this is the book about the facet. Okay. Yeah, that's the book right there. Okay. Oh, wow. That's cool. After research, I had to... Am I supposed to see that or just Quincy? Uh, technically Quincy, but yeah. it's, it's open to everyone. I had recent oh. break. Hmm. The Foss. I've done Aqua Lab. I hope to create just... a special So, Ernie, deep. whenever you're ready for your RP. All right, you're back. Cool. Oh, no. <laughs> Devil with a British accent. Yes. Come on, Ernie, give us something good. Give us something you good. You say that my daughter wasn't returned. Oh, come on! Wait, what did you say, Ernie? You say that my daughter wasn't returned? I am so apologetic. You see, there was complications with some others that were there in his partner party. I uh, did pay someone else to help me, but apparently they paid him off more. Indeed. So, what should we do now? Or what do you suggest I do now if these problems keep arising? I have nothing to prevent uh, the ability to traverse through the plains. But you do have the ability to traverse across facets. You are correct, Master. And they must exit eventually. Eventually they would. I will keep my scouts out looking for her. Next time they leave, I will be there to... Uh, acquire her with more help Machalo you better not keep this to yourself <laughs> does the uh, mirror go away Ernie yep. alright you, and you would all hear him just walk away well um I'm just going to say, well, let's, let's get the frick out of here, Gunnar. Come on, let's get on this ship. I'm hoping you left the room first. Who, me? Yeah. Yeah, no. I, I was never... You said I heard, like, through the through the door. Oh, like, on the other side of the walls. Yeah. Yeah, I was just listening in. Yeah. I don't think he could understand them. Yeah. Um, okay. But, uh... Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. I'm it. loving it. I'm assuming y'all head back to the boat. Um, yeah, yeah, we have. Uh... Matt would send you all back to the facets. You will see Quincy and Raven there a couple hours later. Oh, um, Realman. What? It Real Realman's on the boat, right? Who? The Minotaur, Realman. He's not on the boat. No, he's at the docks nearby. Oh, okay. I'm gonna. Wait, we gotta we gotta get payment. Wait, wait, go yeah. back, go back. Realman, Realman. I'm gonna get him out by the docks. Raven oh. stays like on the dock. She yeah, doesn't like... go with him. Like, well, dude, he's on the docks. We're both there. Oh yeah, sorry. Yeah. Well, he's, he's in a ha boathouse or whatever. But yeah, okay. um, I don't want to like you, I don't want to leave Raven alone. Can I? Can I like? Is she like? What is Raven doing right now? Is she like dejectedly staring off in the distance? Yep. Okay. It's like, come on. Holding I'm going to like I'm doing the shoulder around like comfort grab. She shrugs it off and she just walks alongside. All right, I just go into the house. Realman. <laughs> Realman! No, oh, huh? Yes! What is it? Oh, hello there. Wait. Where's the rest of your party? Did y'all die? Not yet. Well, that's comforting. Oh, don't worry. It's I a, see no it's bodies a or anything. No it's, a, no, it's a joke. We had a complication. We had to split off, and, uh, it, like, Quincy just, like, I have ways of getting around. He just blinks. Where's my boat? It's coming back. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. It's not damaged, is it? Yeah. No, no. Well, no accounting for Macaulay scratching it. Well, whatever. What? Yeah. I didn't scratch. Freaky. You feel like I feel like you're the, the guy to like put Macaulay was here with your dagger on stuff. Mm, no comment on that. I didn't um, say I did. Yeah. I didn't say Anyways. that. I know, but like that's Quincy's vibe of what your character might do. So but I found the, I we, we found you? this. I presented with a journal. We've got some. Hey, inter well, Oh, by the way, before I give it to him, I wrote that shit down separately, so I have it. Uh, alrighty. Kay. He would look at the journal, he would read it. It's mm -hmm. from the island. 
Oh, I see. Maybe type facet. Well, there's only one entry I can read here. Where's the rest of it? Ah, uh, apparently lost to time or with Mr. Bubblegum. He just blinks. The nice trial. <laughs> oh, he steal it. Ah, uh, because he used this to, well, aggressively trade with us. By which I mean threatened our lives and then traded with us. That's not my problem, is it? No, but this book why is to... Are you me because you asked. You asked why he would have it. He looks at the book. He's like, give you, for each party member that helped acquire this book, I will give you mm, 125 gold. All right. Negotiate, bro. It's like, <laughs> wait, oh, wait, I can negotiate? I don't wait. know, can you? Well, fuck, I'm too tired to negotiate. I'm freaking the fuck out right now. I just said all right. Yeah, yeah you're probably right. Quincy wouldn't be asking for more money at this point. Like, I'm, dude, I'm like, my, like, dude, love of my life is literally having a mental breakdown next to me. Yep, yep, no, you're right. <laughs> it's like, I, I said that out of character. I'm trying to explain to Morello I'm asking for more damn money at the moment. Anyways, um, he will hand you a bag of gold with 125. He will also hand you a copy of the original book. Yeah. Wait, wait the original book or the book I handed him? No, he gives you a copy of the book you handed him. All right, okay. So I have that copy. So can you like just put it in my character thing? Well, I mean, it's public to everyone. Okay. It's it's in, it's a handout. Oh, is it, um, is it in Chris's folder or where is it? No, no, it's it's in uh, lore books and stuff. Handouts, books and stuff. Blood soaked journal, or leather bound journal. Leather bound. Okay. Yeah. Um. Yeah, he would close the door. And yeah. After he does that, you see a familiar looking boat magically coming towards you all. Well, they're alive. Hey, they're alive! That's good, right, Ray? Right? Thank God. Which one? Any. <laughs> okay, so I, I'm gonna climb off and go over to Raven. Um, so... You, when you escaped hell, you're being hunted also, now? <coughs> By my father, it seems. And just, like, just, I don't really know magic or anything, but as, like, like on a scale of 1 to 10, how powerful is he? Like, 1 being me, 10 being, Just, like, some... Judging from L. that, it's like, judging from the guy who is his lackey, I'm gonna say maybe a 30. More? Oh, shit. Okay. Okay, so... <laughs> uh... What, guys, what are we, what's the game plan? What are we going to do? The game plan is oh, well. Do you have any? Oh, did you hear anything interesting? You went why, back. You went back from Gunnar. Sorry, 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 sorry. It's like sorry. I meant, I meant to phrase that better. It's like what did you did? It's like did, was Gunnar still with the guy? Sorry, I meant to say. Sorry, I like. I'm, okay, let me rephrase this so I'm not meta gaming. So wait, did was Gunnar still with the guy when you've got found him? Uh no, he was. Gunnar was outside. They were talking. They were talking? What, what the hell did they say? I mean, I, won't, I will tell you privately later. Makala, who was talking with who? It was the hunter and Raven just You really quiet. think this is the best place on some crowded dock right now to tell you what I heard? We should go back to the base. We should go back there. Also, Raven, every single day I'm putting a mind shield on you. Alright? Every single day, every morning, the game is on you. It is not going to be perfect, but it's going to make it at least harder okay. whenever the go if it happens to push into your head. Is Matt here right now? Yeah, Matt, the here. Character. Matt, you know what the fuck a cambion is? Oh, yeah. It's uh, when a mommy or daddy human and a mommy or daddy demon lord love each other very much. Cambion. <laughs> Wait, so is there a difference in, there's a difference between Keithlings and Cambians, right? Yes. Cambians are more abyssal. Uh, well, Laven might be turning into one. Splendid. Did he say that with did he say that with did he say that with sarcasm? No, not sarcasm. Excitement. Oh, you've gotta be kidding. Why do you wreck every time I try to make things up? <laughs> okay. Turn into a Cambian 
technically is an issue. The issue is, if the dad turns her into a Cambrian, what's the chance he's going to make her able to do everything he wants instead of what she wants to do? That's all the issue. <sighs> this is going to... Well, it looks like, from what sounds of things, we need to start getting stronger, everyone. Between, That's why we need a Cambrian. Between this and fucking Scar, we have so much on our plate with Is and the Isothrex, too. Sounds to me that Raven's getting a power boost. I heard uh, Ray was clutching his, you know, body a little bit and convulsing when I, when we last saw him. And I dropped him what? off at the mark, at the base. Well, uh, something about dragons and greed and blood, something along those lines, nothing major. Um, I think he's also going through a metamorphosis state of having his powers I unlocked. I swear to God, if everyone in the session just ends up in a cocoon next session. <laughs> six sessions. Guys, I think I want to move out. <laughs> I don't feel safe when I sleep. <laughs> Um, Michael, I Gunner has to move out, man. He can't even get back to Plan B. <laughs> oh, oh shit! No, he can't. No, he can't get to Plan B. Gunnar can't use my portals. Nope, he can't. So Gunnar can't even get back to the facet. <laughs> well, he can't. Well, so he can use the obelisk. That's all he can use magically. But we don't have an obelisk in base. Different. We don't. So Gunnar's gonna just be chilling out on a, in a tavern. Ah, oh, fuck! 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 The bachelor pad. Yeah, I can get a bachelor pad. Gunnar, are you with a house yet? Nope. Red House has lodging, and I bet you anything they'll like a guy like you. They would. Why, they would. I could use an apprentice, Mitty. I've done work for them before. Yeah. You should join their house especially. Anyways, so, um, I'm still in NBC mat mode. Um, well, did we get anything? I heard someone mentioned a, a leather bound journal. Yeah, apparently there's something made in the deep. I show him at the fucking journal. He would look at it as I reopen it. After research, I had a recent Bray. The Foss just, they are in fact blueprints on almost done. Some type of lab, very crate, something very special in the deep. Don't forget about Aqua. Yeah. Five. Welcome okay, back. so I just thought. Of, so, do you remember that island with the uh, that the water in the middle? Yep. I have a theory. Mm-hmm. That it's a lot of chimeras. There was numbers all over them. I'm betting they were practice experiments. Ah, uh, that's a fair assumption. I think this guy is trying to ma smash something together with a kraken. Or any other aquatic beast, probably. Kraken, shark, dolphin. The Kraken's the only Wait. thing with the deep that is good enough for the deep. Something well, equally as scary that can survive the bottom of the ocean. Sounds like you know your next destination for next week. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> Matt just gives a wink, like, ah, uh, yeah. Uh, well, you know what? We should probably just take some of your firepower along. What do you mean? I've seen what you can do with that damn sword. Remembering Ikunomi's steel flash ability. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like... So, well, I mean, I, someone has to drive the boat. Uh... You know, we could always just hire Gerard. I think Gerard would want to go. He's busy with his research. This is an interesting place that is research. You think a nerd wouldn't love this place? He's busy in helping us figure out what's the, what's, why the Blood Eld is still around. The blood what? Wait, a what? Wait, who? Who? The blood eld. You know the thing Red Crow unleashed? Oh, blood eld. Okay, but he said blood elf, and I was so confused. No, no, blood eld. You know the thing that Crow unleashed, and it should have stopped being, you know, growing in power. Yet it still is. You, you realize know, Matt's never thing? told us about this in character. Uh, you should know about it from Crow, unless Crow never told you. Crow never told me either. No one sold it. No one I, told me. I, I, no, no. I said to everyone at one point in time, I was like, by the way, the apocalypse started. You were all there for it. I'm here, here going. That's all I know is the apocalypse started. I honestly thought you were joking. You said that. I said this to you after you saw an eldritch being. Oh, the abominations! The, abominations. Oh, the abomination episode. That's, okay. That was yeah. the old. Okay. okay, gotcha. Ah, oh, this so, is yeah, just going to be sorry. My bad. With that stuff. Gotcha. What about Lena? Scott. She'd be interested in getting some stuff from here. Ooh, maybe Mal. 
she's only interested in metals, and I, she doesn't want to get her hands dirty and get messed up. Do you think up Mal would be interested? We get it for her. Yeah. Do you think Mal? Mal I mean, would be interested Mal's to inter te test no. her bombs here. I doubt anyone would actually want to come with us. Well, hmm. it's like you could ask for help. Like they could probably equip us with stuff, but that's about it. Hmm. I get. I guess that. I get that. But what I'm saying is. This is a very dangerous island full of people that outclass me, outclass Dritska, and definitely outclass Sunderwood and even you. And all I'm saying is the monster, we could use their extra firepower. Or they outclass us. Or we could all just get good. That's also an option. How do you get good by standing on a boat? Up. Well, I mean, I he holds a, a magic book. I do reading. Basically. That merchant, that merchant fellow, is also willing to trade for power. Both Ray and Raven got something out of it, thankfully. Someone's using it properly, other than myself. <sighs> Fine. Also, we finally found a different animal besides me. Oh, good. Oh, is it that drow fellow? No. You sure? Because he mentioned your name, and he could teleport. Well, you can teleport too, can't you? Yeah, but his was like yours. But mine's portals. His is just. Okay. Wait, that guy was an Anamancer, right? Like he wanted your dagger. What dagger? <sighs> oh, I thought Matt told me about the dagger. Sorry. No, no one knew about in character. No one knew in character about the dagger. I've never actually used it in character because we had to retcon me killing Matt. Actually, no, no, you did try to use it once. I've tried but to use it like it... multiple times. No one no, wanted no, to help Quincy, me. Quincy, Quincy, you gave it the crow, and you told crow how it worked, and crow put it back. Said no, fuck that. <laughs> yeah, no one used it, and but crow's dead, crow... so no one else knows about it. <laughs> <laughs> the secret secret did. Anyways, uh, um, <clears throat> fine. It's like I don't know what the hell he is, but he's. He's a very nice fellow. I quite enjoy his company. What you do? Thank you, Wick. You put the word took out of my mouth. What did you say, Wick? I didn't say, I didn't say anything. You, oh. said, you said, of course you do. Oh, yeah. Yeah, sorry. That's it. Well, he, he just wanted to talk. <laughs> he, asked, he asked about you and all that kind of stuff. I didn't tell him much. What else did he ask you about? Oh, just our progress on things. If we knew a guy in a hat who was looking for a devil. He thought it was me. Told him I didn't know anyone else. So, you know. Well, actually, thinking where Rave should stay, I don't think she should stay. I actually thinking she don't, I don't think she should stay on the plan B facet. For two reasons. One, isn't it, one, it's, um, by itself. So if they find that facet, which will be further from the convergence, Kinda of screwed. Secondly, how many how many adventurers are on the convergence? The chance of them making a strike here would be dangerous. So, worst case, worse. Inquisitor College has a spare room I can loan her out as a, as a quotation mark student, so she can borrow it for a short period of time, and she can stay there for a bit when she's not doing her own stuff. That's well, there, could just crash at Lena's. I, mean, I think she's gonna be fine on our percent, you know. If, like you said, Wick, if he, you're putting the mind shield on her and everything, I'm pretty sure we'll slow them down trying to find her. Also, Wait. she's gonna be going back and forth to Convergence, if not every day, every other day. So. I'd rather oh. not be far away from you all, if I be honest. No, nope, Raven, you're gonna stay right here with us. I'm just gonna say my mind shielding is out of ten, a solid four. Uh, Ernie, how good is it to at least stop people from finding someone? If I put a mind shield on someone, how good is it to stop them from finding them, Ernie? Oh, sod awful. Yes, it's sod awful. I have not trained. I can start training that if I had an item to help with mental stuff. I could a lot easily do this stuff, but I don't. I'm going up my own mental strength, and it's not amazing just yet. Well, Raven, how long have you been out of hell? A few months? Years. And they just finally had someone find you when you went to a facet that was brand new and unclaimed? Yes. Hmm. Sounds to me like we have plenty of time. If it took them this long to find you on one facet, 
and he had to have help from the drow to find you all by himself i think he's going to be hard pressed for time i mean it's not like he can just you know just teleport and travel like you can and i can well we never saw a boat he could have come earlier and just waited it's a big it's a big facet we didn't couldn't see yeah. from every side of it he could have overheard yeah. Matt getting the boat and had heard rumors of me being with Plan B. Yeah, Plan B is kind of popular. Th that would mean the community. Oh, gosh. Shit, we are popular. Wait, why are we popular? Dude, we've uh, literally, we literally we literally were called in on this hand-picked mission before. We have defeated we defeated it Welfer, which is a big He's thing. So yeah, Plan B is like on a famous skill, about like a two or a three out of ten at this point. It's like, what's the deal? We are. I'm sorry, Jim, doing... but can we just go back to Plan B already, please? Is That's... that what the headquarters is called too? Yeah. No. Is it actually just the name of a place? Can we, go, can we just go back to the base. That's that's we just call it the base. We didn't come up with a name for it. We need a name. Machalo, you can freely name it if you want. No, because then you guys are gonna be like, no, Machalo, that name sucks. I honestly don't give a shit at this leader, point. As the leader, I give you permission. Yeah. Name it. Yeah. What are you guys doing? Yeah. Naming the base. We're going back. And we're going back there. Well. Alright, the Italian stallion it is. Let's go. <laughs> the, the, the base is called Plan B's base. It's, I, I own it. So I'm the owner. That is so freaking stupid. Matt, come on. Think Matt, we helped you kill the people to get this place. Chris and I... It's Technically, it was yeah. my money that... Yes, yes. Can... We just go. That's what I'm trying to do. Okay, all right. I need to talk to Matt in a minute. Matt, when you're free, I need to talk to you. Yeah, we can go. No, talk. This is. Do we want to? Okay. Do we want to like, have like end. RP voice right now? Just back in base. Yeah. Yeah, we, yeah, we can we, go back to base. Because like I'm, I mean, like I'm messaging Ernie right now, so I'm a little distracted. Sorry. I know, because, yeah, like... Cause, uh, the... Session's over. Let me award the XP. Well, Session's uh, over, but, like, I feel like a lot of RP is going to happen, so do you guys want to just gonna stay on voice for a bit longer? <gasps> I level up. I level up. Finally, I level up fucking four. You guys did pretty much everything correctly, so... Yeah. Oh, correctly, yeah. meaning, oh, I have to get neutered. I dropped two monsters. <laughs> um... Can... Can you also send me the stats for that? Uh, cape when you get a chance, please. Right, um, yeah. now I ha Oh god, I have some bullshit now, by the way. This is fun. Okay. Ah, well, I've almost broke a thousand experience points. Oh, sorry, ten thousand. <sighs> Crow was so much ahead than you fuckers. Well, yeah, well, how close are you to level six? Uh, Crow was like... 9k. Wait, I'll check. He was on about when he died. It was like you could sleep ago. with a crow plushie. I'm just wondering. <laughs> I love crow so much. He was so much fun. All right? Dude, I literally tried to save his life. You didn't you listen to that episode, Machala? Crow had, yeah. had the most emotionally enough. charged episode we ever had. <laughs> like, I mean, if Matt so, versus Quincy during the uh, actual attack was an episode, that probably would have been higher. But. Okay, um, by the way, Wick has a new spell. Oh, boy. Ew. Is it good? Alright, alright, all right, all right, um, everyone will see just Matt look over at Raven and just be like, we got four minutes and 30 seconds. Come with me. And he'll open the portal, push her through, and close the portal behind him. <laughs> what the frick? Can I jump in? No, Matt closes it for you. Get... You are slower than me, that. bitch. I want to make a dex move to try to run in. Uh, they've run already in. all went in the fucking secret room. <laughs> Get fucking wrecked, scrubs. I'm surprised. Oh, <clears throat> just surprised Quincy hasn't tried to cut off my finger and give the ring to uh, Raven. Because I'm not a dick. Well, see, here's the thing. Cut the... Okay, here's the thing. If they cut the ring off right, technically, depending how the curse works, one, we get Leo to regrow your finger within, like, a minute. Which yeah. Is and crazy. also, or none of us actually knew how the ring worked. I didn't so, remember. I didn't know so, my magic didn't affect you until I tried to help get, get us all to escape. This is after. This is after fact. This is full yeah. time. So te technically, if the curse worked just for you, if you remove it, technically, Gunner, and you could remove it and unmove it at any time you want to, that might be better. Just chop the finger off, see what happens. 
Well, he said if I lose my hand, I lose the uh, the ring, so... The finger would work, too, yeah. I would assume the finger... But you'd, know, like... The yeah. body part holding on the ring would go. But you'd have to, like, dig out the finger out of the ring, probably. Yeah. Uh, guys, I'm gonna top off voice. I'll do RP in a bit so I can tell people that I want to about the whole thing. Yeah. Well, my downtime's got screwed up this week. Yeah, mine too. I was supposed to get a prestige class this session, but I didn't know I had to actually do something to get it. You didn't know you had to do yeah. stuff to get prestige? I didn't know. I didn't know, like, like how it was going to work. Because Matt said, oh, I came up with this awesome prestige class. You might get it next session. And I'm Wait, like, oh, Matt so did know. it? He probably, it might have just gotten beat up by Ernie. <coughs> if, uh, Matt, if Matt's the one who told you you made it up. No, because he checked well, with Ernie. Yeah. But he said, no, you got to do research. You actually have to do stuff for it. And I said, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. if you're going to get prestige classes, as to get, okay, how to get prestige classes 101. You got to fill these set quota things in. The quotas can be like, hey, you could be like, oh, kill 10 puppies or something. I don't know. You fill in the quota, all right? Once you fill in set quota and use the set ability, you know, you can use an example for Mystic, Corrupted Mystic. I had legit have a demon ducking thing in my head and agree, have it agree to give me sonic powers. It's, it's harder than it, it sounds harder than it actually was, but hey. Um, Shit, I don't. Other, one, other ones yeah, well... like Quincy trained for a glove for a long last time. Crow can make, make seven fucking billion deals with blood demons. That's a thing. Yeah, it's all, it's all interesting. Well, uh, see you guys. Miles go dark. <laughs> Just go edgy. Just, just become the most edgy fucking paladin you can think of. Dritska becomes Batman, but murder. By the way, Dritz, by the way, Dritska, fuck your AC now. By the way. Yeah. Dritska, Shh, Dritska's, yeah, Dritska's dude. Dritska's muted. Gosh, no, he's muted because he has pushed. I can hear. On. Oh. No, I put the talk on. He's mic muted. Yep. For a reason. <laughs> Dritska, uh, Dritska, I can hear And Raven right. walk back out of a new portal. Ah, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck just um, happened? I saved your life. What you do? What you do? I like a Raven for like confirmation. Eh, she nods. Essentially, my boss eh, helped save her. What? Oh, the Dazi boss. and her dad have a booty call thing going on? Yeah. Uh, basically, her dad called my boss because I was meddling in with his affairs. So then, yeah. my boss called me. Is like, yo, what the fuck? We got five minutes. I can't hold him hold for very long. I took Raven to meet her. She signed a contract that was identical to mine. Now Daziel prevents her daddy from taking her back to hell. What's in that fucking contract? Essentially, she works for Daziel, and Daziel makes sure her dad doesn't take her away. Same okay. thing I have. I... Word for word. Just different name change. Okay. See, all good. So long as she doesn't die, her daddy can't take her back to hell. So wait. He would die. So you have to keep me alive then too. Well, so long as you guys are in a relationship together, yeah. And I don't I'm have to keep you alive. If I, if either of me or Raven dies, the other does. Oh, you both will become out. dominion. Oh wait, do we not know that in I character? Like out, I'd like to point out that technically, Matt doesn't yeah. have to keep either of you alive. It's yeah, just I don't like, have to keep you alive. It's just out of if good If Raven way. does die, inheritance of it gets us all. Okay, what I'm saying is, but if it, no, I'm talking about I'm talking about the lover's feet. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Well, that's what I'm saying. Matt doesn't have to keep you alive. Yeah. Well, nor he does. does he have to keep Raven alive. He's doing so. Yeah, out of good to. will. Yeah, but he doesn't have to. Okay. Yeah. Well, I'm saying uh, what I meant. Well, I didn't say have to, as in like an order. I'm just saying if he wants to keep her alive, I have to stay alive as well. Unless she falls out of love with you out of character. Eh? Oof. Big oof. Big oof. That'd be a big oof. Very big. Hey, Ernie, speaking of big oofs, I now have fucking trees. Are you, oof, are you happy with me? Yeah. That's gonna be really uh, fucking hard at this point. Because <laughs> I think of everything like Raven has done in our beach chat, especially with like the almost murdering Quincy. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> so, I like um, how yeah. still be in his room, pottering away. Hi, Car! I'm sorry we didn't get you any blood! You see him sort of stick his head out to flip me the middle finger and then stick his head back into his left. We did find a guy that you might like to know about. 
Did he have shadow points? Probably, yeah! Oh Maybe! Did you see him use any? No, but I saw him summon a giant fuck off sword and then disappear in the shadows! That's not shadow points, you're useless. It's like. Are you going to Umbermancy? God damn it! <laughs> wait, wait! Have you talked to the Dragon yet? Oh, god Ew. damn it, Quitsy! Never mind! No, 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 you said something. <laughs> Have you talked to dragons yet? Dragons? Yeah! Shadow the dragons! Do you know one? Yeah! You? We know a lot you of know dragons! Isn't insane? No! Alright. You're still useless. Alright! Quincy is useless. That's the guy who stays in base every day. The second big of today was that. Well, I've been busy trying to buy more ink. You don't need all it. of it. Heck yeah, I literally gave you the second supply of ink, which is like at least four more like cartridges, like four more. <laughs> you underestimate how much ink I use. Okay. What the hell are you making with all this ink? A lot yeah, of I stuff. I care, I care. How much of like in liters? Can we get you like a squid or something? I mean, if you could get me a squid, that'd be pretty useful. Matt, Matt just kind of like says, well, I do know where a giant squid is with magic ink inside of it. And we, might, useful as well. and we might be finding a giant chimera kraken soon that might have a lot of ink. Uh, that would be very useful. If you're wondering why I'm using so much ink, you'd see him sort of like, sort of chuck out an envelope into the main room. You know, it's a lot easier if you come outside. Pick it up, Chant, really. busy writing. What are you, Hamilton? <laughs> and Hamilton wrote the other 51! <laughs> Opens it up. Yeah. Mm. The second you, like, go to sort of move the envelope, but, like, the thing would just explode in a burst of light. <laughs> okay, then. You're making paper flashbangs? Wasn't very nice. Hmm. Oh, he left right when we're doing this part. Alright, so this is weird comedy. It's like, great. So, you. I'm gonna talk to Ra I'm gonna to Raven. So, you're stuck in a contract town too, huh? Seems so. Matt, what kind of, she's not stuck in it. She can leave anytime she wants to. She just has to die. Do you hear what. Do you think about what you say before you say it? I just said what's true. She's not stuck in it. Her life. I, I saved her life today, Quincy. If anything, you should be thanking me. Otherwise, she would be whisked off to hell right now, and she'd be stuck with her daddy. Hey, hey. I didn't have to do it. You know why I did it, Quincy? Because I care about her. Matt, if you actually cared, you wouldn't be so concerned about telling me about it. No, no, no. I do. I am concerned to tell you about it, because you think Matt, I'm just some Matt, big bad guy. Matt, Matt, friends don't pull receipts. Friends don't say everything you've ever done for them and try to guilt them into liking you. People I who care don't anyone. fucking do that. I just said what happened. <laughs> okay, Raven. Raven says shut up. <sighs> now, on a side note, pops in my Matt, yeah. you go to that side. Quincy, you go to that side. I need to talk to Matt first, and then Raven when she's not about to throw out. Um, please don't kill Yuki and everyone. Uh Please and hopefully you enjoy your day, and uh, if you see anyone following you in the corner, please alert the nearest guard if you're on the convergence, or run like hell. Everyone okay? <laughs> Everyone take a deep breath in? Okay, I'm guessing Raven is just gonna storm off to a room or something? Yeah. Gotcha. She's gonna storm up and find, and find Valkyrie. <laughs> find Hello. Yuki flying... <laughs> find Yuki flying around, <laughs> like picking up the and flying the around. The bird may around. die if the bird lands on her horn, telling you here and fucking now. Yuki's with Yuki's with Ranker. Good. <sighs> Gonna feed Yuki too. Huh. Okay, seriously, out of character though, you do realize how much of a asshole thing that was to say, right? Huh? Out of character, you realize how that sounded coming out of Matt's mouth, right? What? What? I said a lot of things today. Okay, the thing about like she can get out of it, she just has to die. I mean, technically, he's right. He's I'm, right, but I'm, I'm saying, right. like, the way Matt said it. Do you realize how that reads to everybody? To most, like, people with normal? I mean, he's technically not wrong. He's technically not wrong, but I'm saying, like, 
saying that killing yourself is a choice. Killing yourself is the only other option. I didn't say she had to kill herself. Okay, die. Dying die. is the only other option to get out of the contract. Like you're saying, like she has a choice. It's like either die or stay in. Well, that or was the choice. Yeah. Or it's, she could have, you know, not signed it and been taken back to her daddy. Matt I did this. I get that Matt did this. I'm asking if you as a person realize how that read. I don't care how that read. Both in character and out of character. Loving that evil alignment. I mean, <laughs> I'm just like out of character. I want to know why her dad's fucking looking for her again. Uh, I'm just because, like... Because, uh, bitch, he, he, daddy wants you back. He, he wants his little perfect slave. <laughs> Wow! Uh -huh. Wow! We know no, she basically was. Wow! We need to. Wait, what? Political marriage. DM, DM talk. Political marriages are a big thing now. Oh, oh that too. Oh, oh fuck! No, 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 no. Oh fuck! She's in love with a fucking. I didn't hear, I didn't hear what Ernie said. What? Political marriage. <laughs> oh my god! Oh god! No, the drama. The drama. Any question? Shit! I need to find that moonblade fast. How high a marriage are we? Out of character. How high a marriage? Like you know, a lord? Like high? Like no? What, what rank? Is, is well, you have to realize, Raven's dad is essentially Asmodeus's account. Oh, oh shit! Pretty <laughs> high up. Mm -hmm. right. He's How the dude who count. He's a dude who check like soul quotas for everyone. It's like, are you fulfilling your soul quota? Yeah, you're fulfilling your soul quota. Ooh, yeah, not. To the blood war you go, my friend. So he's Adra Malik. Basically, yeah. <sighs> it's like that high up, so she will get married off. She'll get, she'll get, she's getting, she's either getting married up, either across to essentially another direct servant's son of, like Asmodeus is like, uh, I don't know, generals. Yeah. Or, oh. or getting married up one level to, Asmodeus. to well, no, no, to the child of a devil lord, or really low chance two steps up to a devil lord. That's like 0.1%. Oh, dear god, this plotline actually is interesting. You're welcome. Raven's plotline's easy to do. It's just devils, and devils are easy. I mean, devils... Devils are, <laughs> devils are easy. Devils are yeah. Yeah. I guess devils are... Devils. I guess devils are paperwork, but... I'm, Ernie, you're talking about all the dramas happening within the within the group. I'm just fighting yeah. against this. Oh, fuck, fuck. Cool. Now I gotta go kill the uh, devil. Yeah, Matt's gonna be up in his room. You want to go talk to him? Uh, I need to talk to him. Uh, we got the the magic of private messaging. Uh, um, <clears throat> actually, I'll have the cold because I'm kind of constrained. Uh, oh, okay. Can I talk to Matt since I'm kind of stuck outside? You know? Oh yeah, what's up? Oh, you said you can help find an apartment. Oh yeah, Matt will help you find a. Well, he will point you toward the red house and tell you to go join them, and they'll let you stay there for free. Okay. Basically. Just be really good at not dying, and be really good at making things die. Roger. Driska can help you with that. Alright. Next time Matt... Go it may into be better here. next time after I'm gonna try to rank up. Okay. So, okay. Okay, so would Matt... Does Matt know in character about political the political marriages? I would know about political marriages in no, character. No, no, would you know... Th th would you know that Raven's being sold off like that? I would not, no. Okay. I'm asking if we can gain the information Ernie just gave us or not anyway in character right now. Um, no, you cannot. Unless you call up her dad. <laughs> hey! I'm the guy I'm the guy screwing your daughter. <laughs> You're dead. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wait, wait, wait. Here's the thing. So, wait. Oh my you god, know? dude. I'm literally... No. Dude, by being in love with Raven, I'm literally stealing from Asmodeus' accountant. <laughs> 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 Ultimate <laughs> rogue status. <laughs> Since he can't kill you, imagine he just picks you up, finds you in a chair, and throws you through the seventh circle of hell, and just leaves you right there in a chair where you can't fucking die. Yeah, that's what's gonna happen. I can yeah. literally portal out of hell, remember? Yeah, not... yeah. Go through seven layers of hell. Yeah, that, that's... Happening. No, dude, literally, how the astral... Remember our cosmology is the same as the astral plane? I can literally visit any plane I want. <laughs> yeah, but I can get... A, but I will get fucking but. killed on every lawful plane. Yeah, unless you wanna strike a deal. <laughs> There's no way out of hell. There yeah. is. So wait, why do I have to strike a deal if I don't? If, like the only thing I have with the problem is I roll a one. 
Or are you assuming that if you go out, that they can't follow you? I mean, can. I'm just assuming I can run fast! <laughs> are you assuming that the 20 foot tall devil can't run faster? Not when oh, I have 16 oh, strength in the Astral Realm, bitch! Not you... when they have 25. It's like, bonus action dash and main action dash! Bonus action dash, main action dash, free action dash? Oh, fuck you! <laughs> there are fast things in hell, such as Hellhounds. <laughs> fuck you, free action dash? Fuck oh, you! Oh yeah, Ernie, how, how's my um, pet project that asked Asiel to help take care of going? Uh, that's still going. Oh, still, What? how much longer is it going to take? Well, she has to negotiate with the Emerald Courts, my friend. They are not big fans of negotiation. Emerald Court? Yeah, the Shadow Courts. Okay. I, oh, I, Umbral, I, Umbral, okay. No, Emerald. Last, probably... last I talked to her, she was training it. We have Umbral Magic with the Emerald Court. Yeah. I typed oh, that on Discord to make sure. But Umbral, um, yeah. Because I'm hearing uh, Emerald, and Umbral's pretty. different. Um, so... She's training it, right? Is that is that where at, or was she still trying to get it? She's still she's training it, but she's come to an impasse and is having to reopen negotiations. Got it. Okay. If she needs my help at all, just let she's free to ask me. By the way, I'm willing to help. <laughs> Ernie, what do I gotta do to get into the uh, red house there? Uh, you can get in fine because all of the mines are magical. So you just sort of walk in. <laughs> Everyone's like, "The fuck is this guy?" A badass mother trucker! <laughs> for, context, no, no, for context, there's some interesting content. The first time Crow did this, he threw some pebbles, warps, and landmines, and ran through and got like half his HP blown out and flung to the fucking entrance door, and then got into the red house. And you just fucking walk in. <laughs> I do have a letter of, you know, introduction from Dritska. Nah, this is way better. <laughs> well, after I get through all the stuff, I just, like, give him a letter. Okay, so now I owe a fucking point. favor to this guy in the Starlight Court. Oh, hey, Gunna, God. You just me. I said Quincy. Gunna, so you just proved... Just saying, Quincy, you did everything correctly, pretty much. I, like, I get that. Well, dude, I, I literally went through every other option I possibly had. Oh, no, there, there were other options. They were just the wrong option. <laughs> no, the other option was to fucking fight, and that would have killed us all. It's an option. That's the wrong option. You could have killed the drow. The drow is killable, tenable. Well, well, actually, not anymore. Yeah. No, wait, no, not anymore. Actually, you lost the ability to kill him. So you said his soul health was massive. It is. Yeah, a lot actually. Uh, too bad you didn't look at him. And uh... I wait. It changed. A little bit. Okay, how I much of this- I actual character sheet. How- Oh, fuck you. How much of this was you just wanting to get soul thrown away from me? I wanna know honestly. 10%, 15%. Okay, at least- I know there was part of it was there. And 50% yeah. is um, not non negligible I, I, I'm not at liberty to tell you why or who or what or where or when the other 85% is, but uh, yeah, it's there. I, I said I can't confirm or deny anything. Um, my I am signed into a contract of DMs of not hmm. being able to say anything. It's like now you know how I fucking feel when I have so many things I couldn't tell anybody. <laughs> it's annoying, isn't it, Matt? <sighs> also, Quincy, I need to send you the ranks for the uh, Star Moonlight Corp. Star Starlight, you mean? Starlight. Yeah, because I'm a squire right now. Uh, so I'm gonna send you the ranks that you need to move up through. Gotcha. Alright, um, I need to take a voice call with someone else. I'll oh, shit! I can actually do that? Yeah, you can climb the ranks. But, isn't the main guy the P-word? Rietas? Yeah. He's the king. Oh, I thought you said he was the prince. King, the king and prince rank are the same. Oh. That's just the generic template. Oh, okay. Because like, cause those that's, that's are very different things in real life, Ernie. <laughs> they are very different things in real life, but according to the Fate Wars, they're basically the same. A prince is just a king who isn't legally recognized by... Well, it's recognized by less than 50% of the other courts. Okay. And this is a new court. Okay, so I need... Oh, great. So I'm guessing I just got claimed as an apprentice by Mr. Bubblegum? Uh, no. By calling me Squire, that's just simply acknowledging your title. Okay. You are Squire. 
She is Night Banner. Night Banner. Oh fuck me! <laughs> <laughs> He's so high. Yeah, he'll be high above me. For you. Yeah. I hate you. I hate you and your laws so much right now. I love the Fae, and I love Devils. They are my two favourite. Oh boy. Of the basis that both of them are very much fans of contracts. I never <laughs> signed a contract for the Starlight Court. I know. But they are, I never think you did, but they are both big fans of both. Which is why they are my two favourite. Yeah. I thought favourites oh, should... favor would be chaotic. They are. They'll sign contracts, and they'll generally stick to them. Gotcha. But there will always be a loophole built into the contract. Oh god. My god, what? Oh. Quincy's... Also, I need to deduct three gold, because I have bought uh, three gold worth of ink. Okay. Oh wait, I know what I can do. You need all the ink. Oh wait, shit, I'm I still... need so much ink. Shit, I'm still recording! Yeah. Is there anything else relevant yeah. going on? Uh, no. <laughs>